Ladies and gentlemen, it is finally here. The 2020-2021 college football season is underway. We've got the Central Arkansas Bears going up against For the first time in our memory, Whoa, going up against the Austin PV Governors. It's going to be a fun one. You guys have known for so long I've been waiting for this exact moment. For as long as anybody can remember, college football is here, ladies and gentlemen. Now, I appreciate everyone tuning in. Welcome on into the stream, everybody. It should be a fun one here today. College football, ladies and gentlemen, is on our hands. It's here. Nobody thought it was going to happen back just a few days or months ago. But yeah, look at us now, baby. Kicking off the 2020-2021 football season with... Central Arkansas and Austin PV. What is going on, everybody? I do appreciate everyone tuning on into the stream. Let's freaking go. We got, hold on, let's go all the way to the top. We got Joe Clement, Vidya, Ion Tupper, Noah S., Daniel Miller, Little Easy. I'll do my best tomorrow, brother. Amario Davis, Jacob Rusco, Little Easy, Jaquan, my brother. What's going on, Mahomes, the friend Bray Wyatt, Ian Clark, Monta, John, Autumn, what's going on? Or Jocelyn Pickleman, John Henley, FBS Sports, Tyler. Oh my goodness, y'all are awesome, man. Diego, John Morales. Let's freaking go. Should be a fun one here today. Again, sorry about all this lighting stuff. It's gonna get fixed on soon. Oh, oh, it, it'll get it'll it'll lighten up here in a bit. Hold on, y'all. There we go. But welcome on into the stream. Let's go Central Arkansas. That is my favorite college football team. Well, best of luck to you and your Central Arkansas team today, man. You know, I just decided, you know, kind of last minute that I wanted to stream this game. College football is my favorite sport. I know a lot of you who are on this channel love watching my NBA play by play. Oh, college football is going to be a whole nother level, man. It really is. I know someone trolled on the dislikes, man. John Henley, it's the real, ah, I'm just kidding, but it's football, man, it is football, college football has arrived, let me know down in the comment section below who you guys are cheering for in this game, drop it down in the comment section below, and if you have not done so already, smash up the like button, and hit that subscribe button as well, if you guys are new to the channel, we're going to be doing this type of content all college football season long. College football on Saturdays, we will be doing four college football streams a day, 12 o'clock game, 3.30 game, 7.00. 30 or 8 o'clock game, and then the 10 o'clock game. So college football is going to be lit this year. And we get to start off with an FCS matchup that actually, you know, these these two games are very, are sorry, these two teams are very uh, good for their respective levels. Um, we saw the Austin, uh, Austin PV Governors, they went 11-4 last season. Um, and then the Central Arkansas had a slightly lower year, but still had a very decent year. So I'm excited for this one. I've got Central Arkansas taking the dub. Let me know in the comment section below who you got taking the dub today. And if you guess the score exactly right, guys, if you guys guess the score exactly right, I will Venmo you guys $5. All you got to do is guess the, guess the score exactly right. What time is the Marshall game on Saturday? I am probably going to be covering that one, but let me get that for you guys um, here. Man, oh man, this one is going to be a fun one, guys. Again, smash up the like button, guys. Smash it up. How many likes are we at right now? We are, uh, Let's see. Let's see. We are at Almost at 30 likes, guys, so smash up the like button. Let's see. I'll read you guys my schedule. I'm doing uh, the next game I will be doing, I believe, is Central Arkansas again on Thursday. So we're going to be doing tons of uh, football here again on the channel, man. This is kind of the main thing uh, that we do do. So do appreciate everyone stopping on it. It's my man Vintage. Welcome on into the building, man. Welcome on into the building, man. I appreciate you stopping on it. And my favorite uh, football team right here, the University of South Florida. Uh, and they play in the American. I'm sure you've heard of them. I'm going with 28-21. Uh, Arkansas. All right, man. We shall see. Man. Again, should be a fun one. I mean, I'm not expecting the biggest turnout tonight. It's FCS football, but should again, it should still be a fun one. The Eastern Kentucky. Oh, it's Eastern Kentucky versus Marshall at 1 p.m. on Saturday. But I'm probably gonna do Middle Tennessee versus Army. Now that I think about it, on uh for that 1:30. 
game. Now that you know, now that I think about it, Autumn's got 37 to 10 Central Arkansas taking the dub. But really do appreciate dog. You know I'm gonna be flipping, but yes, sir, man. I appreciate it. I I know, man. Hey, and Dame's out, so it's gonna be tough, but hey, you made it this far. So will you share the game? Due to copyright regulations that um YouTube does have in place, I'm not allowed to show the game. But if you guys see here, um I, I've got the team's logos, I've got the scoreboard that I will be changing. So for example, touchdown central Arkansas. Boom, six, and I just can alternate the scores just like that. And then right here where you see a pregame, this is where you will see first down and ten. So you always know what down it is here. Um, all that good stuff. Just picture this like a radio broadcast, but due to the copyright regulations, um, that is, uh, this is the most that I can do. Yes, it is a uh, small college FCS. FCS level. What division is Arkansas in? Central Arkansas is in, well, I know they're in the FCS division. Uh, and they're in the F FCS, but I'm not like, exactly sure like what type of division they are in in the FCS. Um, that I would not be able to, um, you know, answer for you. But will you? Uh, yeah, I already answered that. What channel is the game on? This game is on ESPN. Little man, do you know who the UTEP Miners are? Yes, of course I do. Uh, Utah's game is tomorrow, John. Utah's game is tomorrow. Never mind, bro. I'll stick around here. I'll play Portland on another vice and chill in here. Yes, sir. I appreciate it, man. Again, on your way into the stream, guys. Smash up that like button, guys. Smash up the like. And if you guys are new to the channel as well, hit that subscribe button, guys. It really does help out with the channel, guys. Again, I really do appreciate everyone who is stopping it on in. Hope you guys do enjoy the stream. We'll be covering the play-by-play -play reaction the entire game long here today. And it should be a fun one here today, guys. And just so you guys know as well, whoever has the ball, this little emo or not emoji, but that picture will be up there by the team's logo to so you guys will know the entire game. Who has the ball as well? So you'll know what's going on here in this game. You're not going to be caught left behind. I can assure you, you guys will know what is going on, guys. Do appreciate it. It's all about the UTA. Yeah, I mean, mystery. They're not the best team. I'll tell you that, though, for sure. They're for sure not the best. Hey, Pickle Man, 14-7. The game's not over, man. Game's not over, Pickle Man. I don't know what you mean. I don't know what you mean, bro, but come on, Central Arkansas, let's get, you know what, I, you know, it doesn't really matter, you know, who wins this game to me, but I, I just want a close matchup, and, and all the articles that I have been reading coming up to this game, it, it, it looks like we're going to see a close matchup here today, so I am super excited, man, welcome in, Tyler, Tyler, how are you doing today, bro, how are you doing, what division is Central Arkansas in, because I don't know, uh, they're in the FCS, let me, uh, look what exact division they are in for. They are in the Southland Division in the FCS. Southland Division in FCS football. So that is what division they are in. We are going to get underway here with tip off. I can tip off. See, this is why I've called too much basketball recently. It's been too long without football. We're going to be on our way with kickoff in just around 13 minutes here, guys. 13 minutes, I would guess, around till we get kickoff here in game number one of the 2020 college football season. You should hold a little man's got talent. Hey, I'm singing on stream once we hit 4K. So, but again, college football streams all season. You know, I, you know, just give this channel a shot. That's what I've got to say, guys. Just. Give the channel a shot. See if you like it. Hit the subscribe. Come back for more college football streams because I'm going to be doing this for all types of divisions, FCS, FBS, and all the way till we crown a championship winner um, sometime in January. Whether that does happen or not, obviously, due to COVID-19 and uh, all, all that stuff. Who, who knows, honestly, what's going to happen in this season? A, a, a truly, any, a, truly anything could happen, man. I, and, and I and I and I and I totally mean that anything could happen in this one, man. Uh, 35-24 Central Arkansas with the win. All right, we shall see, man. Is college football easier to call uh, play by play? I've actually never called uh, play. Well, I have in my head, but I'll let you know at the end of this one what I think is harder. Uh, my guess is college football is going to be a little easier, actually, uh, for me personally. That's what I think, but who knows, man? We're about to find out, though, man. Again, do appreciate everyone tuning on into the stream, man. Hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Again, smash up the like one, guys. Smash up the like. If you guys have not done so already, hit that subscribe button, of course. If you guys are new to the channel, guys, it really does help out with the channel. We're about to get underway here in this one, guys. 
underway to the first quarter of the 2020 football season. Who's your favorite hockey team? You won't believe who uh, my favorite hockey team. It starts with an A and they are in California. You're right. I do not know. Oh, Anaheim Ducks. Yeah, Anaheim Ducks uh, is your hockey team. My hockey team is the Tampa Bay Lightning. So we just actually went up 3-1 in the series today. Uh, I was very excited about that. Uh, but let's see how – okay, we're around 10 more minutes till tip-off. A tip-off kickoff. 10 more minutes till the kickoff of the 2020 in – bruh. To the 2020 college football season. I'm new to the Santo. I literally just subscribed today. Well, I appreciate – uh, you subscribing to the channel, man, really does mean a lot. I believe next Thursday I'll also be live for your Central Arkansas, uh, for Central Arkansas, man. So I hope you will join me in for that one as well. Uh, obviously, you might be able to watch that game, but just figured I would let you know that I should be doing that, um, depending on if it is on ESPN, which I think it will be. There's only one other game on that Thursday night. Um, but it should be a fun one, man. I do appreciate you subscribing to the channel for anybody else that has not. Smash the like, hit the subscribe button, guys, as we keep on growing here today. Welcome in. Welcome in the friend. Bre uh, oh, wait. Uh, my bad. Bro, welcome in. You've been here, man. You have been here. Are you done streaming the NBA playoffs? No, I'm not done streaming the NBA playoffs. I will say, though, that will be very limited now. Um, The NBA playoff streams have not uh, done me amazing. Um, I'm, you know, the right, everyone does the playoffs, so it's a bit more difficult with uh, for it. But, um, of course, I will still be doing it. I'll do a couple more. But I, once we get past round two, um, my college football – I'm at my – I'm at, sorry, my NBA games will most likely be over. And this is – I'm going to still be doing NBA. But college football during college football season, it is college football. It is college football here on this channel, man. We love college football. I'm going to be doing four games on Saturdays. Four games on Saturdays, man. Yes, they are, Wesley. They are. They are looking good, we uh, Wesley, man. I'm excited to see what we can do. What's going on, Philly Sports Reactions? Will, welcome on into the channel. If, if the NBA had any fans, that, uh, they would be there. What What do you mean, bro? NFL is coming in two weeks. That is true, and we'll also be doing um, NFL streams as well. We cover NFL, college football, MLB, NBA, college basketball. We cover everything here on this channel, man. And we got 20 people up in the chat, man. 49ers 2021 Super Bowl chance, man. We shall see, man. I Who knows, man? If you're wondering why I can't watch any college football games, it's because I do not have... Oh, oh well, I, hey. That's why, in part, I run this channel to help people out who can't watch the game just like you. So I'm glad you found the channel, and I hope you are enjoying the stream, and I hope you do enjoy the play-by-play -play reaction. Just in a little bit, does the college football season get underway, guys? Just a little bit. 2020, in, uh, 2020 college football season is here. Yeah, I know that they all carry, but uh, this game's on ESPN. If you don't have, the, you know, the ESPN cable, then you're not going to be able to watch the game. So then CBS and, well, one, NBC and uh, Fox don't carry college football. Well, Fox carries Big Ten football and some Pac-12. Uh, but CBS Sports Net covers a few. But other than that, it's really ESPN, ESPN2, stuff like that. So I think that's why, you know, people tune into the streams. Um... Do a hit, do a hit by hit of the last twenty seconds of this boring boxing match, dude. That they just went to commercial. Otherwise, I totally would though. In two weeks, I'm gonna get ready for football. Yeah, yes, sir, brother. Keep keep up the work, brother. We are about to get underway here in this one, guys. About to get underway with the college football season, man. If you are hyped, let me know in the chat, bro. I, I am so hyped. It is. This is the most excited I've ever been for a FCS game. Ever in my entire life. I don't think I've... I can't remember being more excited for an FCS football game. I, I, but here... I, I, I'm so excited, dude. I, I, dude, this is unbelievable. I cannot believe this is actually happening. I never thought that would be here for college football season. I never I never thought it would happen, but it's happening, and I'm happy. I can't wait to watch my favorite team hopefully get a win today. Well, I hope they do for you, man. Hope they do for you. It should be a good one, man. We're about to get underway. College football is almost here, guys. And we are this close to getting the college football season. CBS has SEC games. Fox mostly Big 12 and Pac-12. Um, and Fox has a lot of Big 10 as well. NBC is for Notre Dame. Yeah. So, Kirk is right, but you forgot uh, Fox does cover a lot of, uh, what do you call it? 
Big Ten, especially the big time Big Ten games as well. So we are just finishing up this boxing match here on ESPN, and then we are going to get underway here with the first college football game. Welcome in, sports fans 09. Welcome in, Diego. Kurt Briggs, if you guys have not done so already before this stream, gets underway. Smash the like button, guys. Smash up the like button. And if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button as well. College football live streams. Every single Saturday, we'll be doing four or three, maybe four sometimes a weekend, depending on when USF football does not have a home game. So, here we go, baby. It is the 2020 college football kickoff. We've got the Central Arkansas, Central Arkansas Bears going up against the Austin PV Generals. We are finally here, ladies and gentlemen. We are finally here. Pre-game still underway here, ladies and gentlemen. It is still underway, so obviously we have not got underway just yet. But the college football season is around the corner. Let's try and get to 35 likes before this stream does get underway, guys. Can we get to 35 likes? Appreciate everyone who is stepping on in. That's true on the Big Ten. But I feel like I mostly... Oh, well, yeah. No, you're right. I'm just saying in general, the, the Big Ten also does get a lot of games on Fox. That, that's the only point I was trying to make for you. That's all. All righty, man. I'll be back at halftime. I'm going to watch. Sounds good, Pickle Man. Will you enjoy yourself watching the game, man? Yes, they made FCA. Yes, that, that is right, Will. Did my, uh, did my favorite college football team, Central Arkansas, make the playoffs last year? Uh, yes. Um, quarterfinals, maybe? May I don't know. I'm not exactly sure, though. Yeah, I think they did, though. I think I, because I was reading up about the game, and and just so you guys know, I've never heard of these two teams before. I was trying to get some names going in my head, but I'll get the names eventually for these teams. Notable team COVID-19 protocols that made this season happen. Daily health screenings and temperature checks, weekly testing, frequent san sanitizing and cleaning, various travel modifications, cloth masks can be worn over face masks. So that is just some of the... Stuff that had to happen. What's going on, Jaquan? Welcome on into the stream, brother. How are you doing today? We are about to get underway here with kickoff here in the 2020 college football season right here on Little Man No Sports Channel, man. Smash that like button. We are almost to 35 likes on the stream. Hit the subscribe button if you are new to the channel as well for more college football live streams just like you are watching here today. And you think this is fun? Just wait till the... Mm, my. I cannot wait, man. This is going to be such a fun season. You should start live streaming high school football games. I don't know. I don't know. If nothing else is on, possibly. Hey, come on, bro. Hey. I mean, I don't know if you was joking, but thank you, bro. Hey, it's nothing great, though. I'll tell you that. It's nothing great, but it's all right, bro. I just need to clear that, clear that from my face. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Just around a couple more minutes. Guys, again, we got 22 people in here. All you guys got to do... Drop a score prediction down in the comment section below. If you guys guess the score prediction right, I will look at the end of the stream and make sure to keep track of yours, and I will check just to make sure. If you guys get the score exactly right, I will Venmo you or PayPal you $5 at the end of this stream. Um, if you guys want to win some money, drop some score predictions down below. We got 27 people in the chat here for opening day of college football. Kickoff is just underway. We are still in pregame right now. Um, and there are some fans here in attendance. I already see some fans for the opposing team of what? What do you call them? Austin PV. Austin PV has got some home away fans here. Thunder suck over. Hey, you killed him today, man. UCA got a first round buying the playoffs and lost at home. Yeah. See, I don't know much about FCS, so thank you for uh, for letting uh, letting the chat know. Welcome on in, everybody. The season is about to kick off and get underway here between Central Arkansas and Austin PV here, ladies and gentlemen. About to get underway. Kirk Riggs is 31, Central Arkansas, and then Austin PV 24. We're about to get underway here for kickoff, so I will change that. And I also, let's see who is going to have the ball first so I can put down who has the ball first on my thing. Welcome in, Justin Herp X. Appreciate you guys tuning on in again. If you have not done so already, guys, smash up that like one, guys. Smash it up, guys. Let's keep it rolling, man. Berlin Smith, the starting quarterback for Central Arkansas today. So it'll be, we'll see what he can bring to the table. Again, I don't know much, I don't know too much about these teams here. I don't know too much because of the fact that I've never done a FCS game in my entire life. But here we are doing it today. 
Justin Matthews, welcome into the stream. He's got 23-17. Austin Peavy getting the dub here. And I'll be back. To, uh, I'll be back. I'm going to watch the Blazers and Lakers. Sounds good, brother. Will you enjoy yourself during that one? And I appreciate it. Hi, man. Welcome on into the stream. Do really do appreciate everyone shopping in. College football about to get underway here for the 2020 season. Well, probably one more commercial timeout, and then we get underway here with football. I mean, this is incredible, guys. It, it might have taken a national pandemic to give us a scare. But, ladies and gentlemen, college football is here. It's happening. You get excited. It's not going anywhere. Let's freaking go, man. Welcome in, Tiffany. Uh, well, welcome in, Brecken. Welcome on in the stream. I do appreciate you stopping it on in. Hope you are doing well here. College football, Brecken. It's crazy, right? It is crazy. College football is actually here today, guys. It, we, are, we are back. 40 to 28 Central Arkansas with the win. I'm going to go 30. I'm going to go. Ooh, I'm going to go 24 to 21. Central Arkansas does secure the dub today. Robert Raquel is a cornerback to watch for uh, Central Arkansas All-American last year. Okay. Thank you for letting me know. I Man, I got my – Kirk Riggs is like my, my stat analysis over here, man. He's got all the information for us in the chat. Do appreciate it, man. The weather here in Montgomery, Alabama, 81 degrees, wind 3 miles per hour. There's a 15% chance of rain, and the field surface today is turf. Here we go. I don't know how you score these games. What do you mean? And whose ball? It's going to be Austin Peavy's ball first. The kickoff is underway. Ladies and gentlemen, college football is about to get underway. Welcome in California Republic. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The players will hold up signs. And we are getting underway with college football. And just the kicker is now walking onto the field. Holds up the sign. Here we go. College football. The 2020 season was in doubt. But we are here. We are live. And the college football season is underway. And the kickoff is back. And it's going to be in the end zone. And Austin Peavy will just take the knee right there. And so they will start the game. First down and 10 at the 25-yard line of their own. Jeremiah, the quarterback here for Austin PV is a redshirt junior. He was born in Brentwood, Tennessee. He has two brothers and three sisters. Just some interesting facts that they are giving during the day. And it is Central Arkansas, I believe, is the home team here in this one. Injured the last uh, week two last season, and he missed the remainder of the season. But he is back here for Austin PV here. The Central Arkansas were the Southland co-champ last year. And Austin Peavy was the Ohio Valley co-champ last year. And here we go. First play from scrimmage. Underway here in college football. First down and 10. Jeremiah looking to come out of the shotgun here as we get underway here to start the college football season. So we'll take, they're taking a little bit of time here, I will say for certain. And here we go. First down and 10 here to start our first playoff from scrimmage. Takes it on the shotgun, and he's going to do a pitch over to the left side. And a nice carry right there to the 40. No way. What a start to the 40. Cuts back to the 30. The 20. He could go the distance. Cuts again. Touchdown. What a start to the 2020 college football season. Are you serious, ladies and gentlemen? Austin Peavy and C.J. Evans on the pitch right there, the QB rolled out of the pocket, pitched it over to Evans Jr., and Evans Jr. explodes down the sideline. And how about this? A 75-yard rushing touchdown to start us off here today, and it's a 6-0 lead for Austin Peavy. Holy crap. What a start for Austin Peavy here to start off the college football season. What a start. That is exactly what you wanted. And the extra point team is on. Unbelievable start to this game right now. College football is back, ladies and gentlemen. One play. That's all it took, guys. It took one play, and we've already got a, a, a score. I mean, that is, oh, that, is, that is absolutely incredible. And the extra point is up. The extra point is good. Seven 
to zero the score just like that. We'll watch it again. The fake handoff. Then he pitches it to the left side as he drew out. And then just bursts right down the sideline. Nobody was going to catch him. He had the safety was back. He then cuts down to the right and just kept hustling. He makes one more cut at around the 10-yard line and finds his way into the end zone. What a fantastic start here to, to, to begin this game. I, I mean, that that is absolutely fantastic. You cannot... I, there, you cannot ask for a better start to a college football game than that. You can, I, I mean, that is great. What a start here today, guys. And Austin PV leads seven nothing, and just like that, it'll now be Central Arkansas. Central Arkansas ball. We'll have kickoff here in just a little bit. CJ Evans, the freshman, and that was his first carry ever. His first carry in the collegiate level goes the distance. How about that, bro? That is something else. That is something else for real, guys. Alrighty, 14-44 here remains in this one. What a game. What a freaking game we have got going on right now. Just like that. And it'll be a kickoff now for Austin Peavy. As Central Arkansas back to return. And the kickoff is underway. And it's booted away. And that's going to be short and caught at the 10-yard line. Here comes Central Arkansas looking to get some momentum. But he's wrapped up before the 20-yard line, taken down at the 18-yard line. And now it's Berlin Smith, the Central Arkansas quarterback, taking the field, looking to respond to the to their early, early deficit here in this one. It was a fantastic play. What a great start for my favorite team, Austin. Hey, bro, come on. I knew you was, I knew you was going to do something like this, man. Oh my, dude, what a start. He's second team, all, he was second team all Southland. He was second team all Southland last uh, season. So first down and 10 here for Central Arkansas. Already down 7 nothing here in this one. He's going to have taken in the shotgun, the running back in motion now. Goes to the left side. He's going to hand it off. Working on the right side. Gets a cut. Now taking it about 5 yards there on the handoff. Nice run right there. A solid play on first down right there, and it'll be second down and five. So second, I believe it'll be second down and five. Um, they haven't said yet. Come on, let, can they get make the second down and four? Second down and four. Here is the shotgun here. Central Arkansas on the shotgun, fakes the handoff, now throws a screen, and he's got a blocker in front, and now making some cuts, and he's going to find some green grass and get around 10 yards on that play, but there is a flag, and that might be coming back for holding right there. It seemed like the tight end mark right there making the block didn't make a holding, and here comes the call from the referee. It's going to be a personal foul, roughing the passer on the defense, and so that's just going to be an added 15 yards to where it already was. Yes, Mike, they do have crowds in attendance today. There are crowds in attendance. Um, there are all socially distant stuff like that, but yes, we there there are crowds here. To, uh, there are crowds um, here today. So first down and 10 now for Austin. I meant uh, for Central Arkansas here. They've got the ball at the Austin PV. 48-yard line. Takes it again out of the shotgun here. Smith drops back in motion. He's going to fire to the side. And another screen pass deflected up. And there's going to be incomplete. Austin Peavy thought he had possession and fumbled right there. But a bad call. Not, not that at all. And it'll be second down and 10 off the incomplete pass right there. 13. 13.53 to go here in the first quarter. It's already 7 nothing. Austin Peavy out on front here today. They one play. And scored right on it. So here we go. Second down and 10. I got to get better at making the. Uh, yeah. All right. Second down and 10 here for Central Arkansas. Takes it again out of the shotgun. He's going to fake the handoff. Got him in on the play action. Throws it deep down the field. And wow, that's a big pass interference right there. And so that'll go to first down and 10 there automatically. A terrible or terrible defense right there. The Austin PV player and the Central Arkansas player got in a in a in exchange right there. An, an intense one too. The somehow the helmet of the Austin PV defender got ripped off. So maybe this could be an offensive pass interference here. I'm not exactly sure it's gonna be a pass interference. 
on the defense, so it will be first down and 10 and another extra 15 yards, and penalties have really been killing the mood here for Austin PV. You know, they got that 7 nothing lead off after the 75-yard rushing touchdown, and the quarterback, he got beat, and he totally just lost his anger. I mean, he, I mean, he totally just lost his anger right there. And I, that was a poor decision right there. Austin P. Okay, got it. All right, thank you for letting me know. He drops back in the pocket. Scrambling to the right side. Throws it deep. Got him, man. Wide open. And he drops the ball. Thank you, for, uh, thank you though for uh, thank you for letting me know though, man. But do appreciate everyone tuning on into the stream, Jacob. I don't think anybody does have a link to the game. Wow, man. Wide open and somehow drops that ball. It was a great scramble over to the right side. Had a man wide open, just could not make the reception there. 13 39 here remaining in the first quarter. It's second down and 10. It's second down and 10 at the central, at the Austin P 36 yard line. Man, oh man, I cannot type. All right, here we go. 10 seconds remaining uh, on the snap clock. Here we go. Takes it out of the shotgun, drops back, looking, looking, throws down the field, got him in! And that might be another pass interference. No, great defense, though. It, it seemed like they might have pushed off a little bit. No call made by the referee, and it goes to third down and 10 now for Central Arkansas at their own 36-yard line. I'm not sure how good their field goal kicker is, and so... This is this is such a big big play right here. At least you want to get a couple yards in knocking the field goal range because when you're looking at it, this is a 53 yard field goal right here. Third down and ten out of the shotgun. Hit Smith now. Taking a while to snap it. Does snap it now. Drops back. Now he's gonna scramble. He's got room and pitches it. What a terrible play right there by Smith. Pitched it right in front. He should have just scrambled away with that one. And it's now fourth down and eight. Fourth down and eight now on the play, and I don't know if they're gonna go for this right here at their own at the opponent's 34-yard line, or if they're gonna kick the long field goal. It would be about 51 yards, and they are gonna go for it. They are going to go for it right here. It's fourth down and seven, 13 minutes to go here in the first quarter. All right, man. Do appreciate everyone who is stepping on into the stream. Here we go, fourth down and seven, a big play for Central Arkansas here, trying to get some momentum back up, they're down seven, nothing here early in this one, and the shotgun once again, drops back, gets under pressure, looking to find someone, he does not, another dropped pass right there by Central Arkansas, and they turn it over, and it's going down in the other direction. Just like that, they turn it over on downs, and it'll be first down and ten for Austin P. just like that, 12.40 to go in the first quarter. We are headed to a commercial timeout. I do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream, man. Welcome on in, everybody. We're at 19. That's a good decision on our part. Yeah, I do agree with that. I agree with going for I like I like being aggressive here early in this game. I do like it, dude. I, I, I like being aggressive. You're down 7-0. So, Austin's starting to play against Arkansas and the rest. Uh, but thank you for letting me know again, fun and hope, love and love. I only know because my ex went to, hey, bro, hey, thanks you for letting me know, bro, but hey, don't bring up the ex. Come on, man. Hey, she don't matter, bro. She don't matter, bro. But do appreciate everyone tuning on into the stream. I know this is not going to be the most heavy looking, uh, heavy, heavy uh, people stream today due to the fact that this is an FCS game, but... Still enjoying calling this game. I'm just so excited that college football is back. Welcome in Chicago plays. Welcome on into the stream, man. Make sure to smash up that like button on your way into the stream, man. And guys, if you are new to the channel as well, guys, smash up that subscribe button, guys. It really does help out with the channel. We are on a commercial timeout, guys. We are on a commercial timeout right now. I do appreciate all the support. I need to, like, signal away so everyone can know that we're on a commercial timeout. I got to, like, add a feature. So, we like, people know, but 16 people in the chat. Appreciate everyone stepping on into the stream. Uh, Black guy was wide open. And dry. I know, yeah, he was. He was wide open, and that was the one where he scrambled to the right side, and he had him, man. He totally had him open, and for some reason, just, I mean, he totally dropped it. Like, he totally dropped it. I, I, I mean, you, I mean, you've got to be able to make that play. I mean, simple as that. And that's stuff like that that's gonna kill you. They would that would have been first down and goal most likely there for Central Arkansas. But instead they ended up getting a turnover on downs. 
Little man, um, you should absolutely not, man. Absolutely not. No not a chance. Man, I love seeing fans in attendance for this game, man. It proves that they can. All you got to do is social distance them. Look at that. Plenty. They're, they're, they're totally social distance. Uh, that, that's a fantastic job, though. As since our Austin P will now take over here at their own 32, at their own 33 yard line, they'll hand it off up the middle to Evans again. Evans fighting and breaking some tackles. It wasn't the best run, but he made it worth it. He's going to pick up two yards on that play, and it'll go down to second and six. Nice, nice carry right there. But that wasn't seven, uh, Evans, though. That was Brian Sneed out of Tampa, Florida, a sophomore, 5'11, 211 pounds. Brian Sneed took the handoff, got, he only got three yards on that one. So, second down and seven, they're lined up in that same formation they just did. Here we go. Takes it out of the gun. Now he drops back, looking, looking. He's going to scramble, and he's going to find some open room, looking for some blockers, got some blockers, and he's going to get past the first down marker and some more. It'll be first down and 10, and Central Arkansas has crossed, I mean, jeez, Austin P has crossed half field, I be, or half field, I believe. So first down and 10 here to Nico Harley and Jeremiah Oatsvall. Players to watch here for Austin P and Robert Ritchell and J.W. Jones. Players to watch for Central Arkansas here in this game. First down and 10 ball at their own 46-yard line here. Austin P has been driving down the driving down the field at such a great pace here so far in this one. Takes it out of the shotgun. Going to hand it off up the middle. Fighting for some extra yards. And you got to love the fierceness of Brian Sneed right there. Not going to pick up a whole lot. But he does pick up four yards on that play. It'll go to second and six. Second down and six here. 11-10 to go here in the first quarter. This game has started out relatively slow so far. Has started off as a relatively slow game so far. 11 minutes to go. Ball at the 50-yard line. Second down and six here. Going to take it again in the shotgun formation. They're lined up in the same formation every single time. It's like two players on the side, one man behind. Oh, they're getting fancy. Oh, the lateral play. Now they throw it deep down the field and cannot make the play. They like, they wanted to get the trick play with the pitch. In the, oh, man. That was a nice play right there. It was, it was a beautifully set up play. Takes it, pitches it right back. And then the running back looks to throw the ball. He had a man downfield, just threw it a little too far right there. And it goes now to third down and six. Such a big play right now for the defense of Central Arkansas because going down 14 to six right now, it's going to be 14 nothing early in this game is obviously not a good sign. Third down and six in the shotgun. The running back right by sound on the left side, drops back, throws for six, and that's going to be incomplete. And it's. No flag is called. The Austin P player wanting the call right there. Would not get it. And it's going to fourth down and six. But they might go for this as well. Just as we saw Central Arkansas go for fourth and six on their last possession. Great defense right there. By He does not have his name on his jersey. But by 33 right there. A great defensive stop. Um, Punks YT due to copyright regulations. I cannot show the game. But I will be giving the live play-by-play -play reaction the entire game. 10 39 to go here in the first quarter. Fourth down and six at the 50 yard line. And Austin P will bring out the punt team here. And Central Arkansas is expecting a fake. And oh, it's a bad snap right there. And he's now going to pick it up and somehow punt this one away. And he does, but a terrible punt then. And it's going to go out of the 40 yard line. A terrible snap right there. Goes behind the punter. He has to go pick it up and then punt it on the run. And it's going to be great field position from Cent for Central Arkansas now. That, 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 and that it's costly errors like that that'll kill you in a game. You've got all the momentum. And, and that was a terrible snap. No wonder we're watching FCS football right now. I, and just has to punt that one away. It was a terrible, terrible punt. And we are going to a commercial timeout. When we do get back, Central Arkansas looks to make a stand here and tie this one up. First down and 10 for Central Arkansas at, their own, at the Boston P 40 yard line when we get back. Welcome in, Luca Buka Sports. Welcome on into the stream, everybody. We got 20 people up in the building. I do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream, man. 
Really do appreciate it, guys. If you guys have not done so already, guys, smash up that like button, guys. And if you are new to the channel, of course, hit that subscribe button, guys. It really does help out with the channel, guys. If this is something you do enjoy, I'm going to be doing this type of content all college football season long. And again, I'm still working on my, I know my college football commentary isn't there yet, but I'm getting there. I just got to, this is exactly why I wanted to call some of these games so I could kind of get into the flow of things with calling these college football games. But do appreciate everyone stopping on into the stream. Hope you guys are enjoying it. We got 18 in the house. Should be a fun rest of this game that we've got going on right now, man. We are on a commercial timeout right now. Commercial timeout. What's going on, General Banco? Welcome on into the stream, man. I appreciate you tuning on in. Who are you cheering for in this one? General, who are you cheering for? Again, we are on a commercial timeout. Austin Peavy started this game with the 75-yard rushing touchdown on the first play from scrimmage to start the 2020 football season. And then Central Arkansas got turnover on downs. And then Austin P drove down to the 50-yard line, had to punt. They had a bad snap on the punt, which forced them to then punt from the 10-yard line. It was then a terrible punt. And now Central Arkansas is taking over at the 40-yard line of Austin P. So great field position here for Central Arkansas here to possibly take control, not take control, but tie this ball game right back up where it was earlier in this game. So here we go, and the cheerleaders are in attendance. Look at that! No, ma oh, they got they've got masks. Never mind. That, I, I I thought for a second I was like I, I, for the protocols that I thought they would have been taken, but they've got their masks. They are socially distancing in the crowd, and they've got the ball at the 38 yard line here. 38 yard line in. It's going to be Smith out of the shotgun, brings the tight end in motion here. Looks back, 10.25 to go. They're going to hand it off up the middle, looking for some blockers, and he's going to power his way through. Going to pick up about five or six yards on that carry, and it'll go down to second down. A nice run right there, nice draw play right there. Fake the pass really nice. Some key players on the offensive side for Central Arkansas. Brendan Smith, the quarterback, and then wide receiver LeJuan Le Winningham. So it's second down now. They're... I hate when they do not, like, pull it up. It is second down and four, and they're going to hand it off right up the middle again. He's powering his way through, and he is going to fall just short of the first down, and it's going to go to third down and one now. Another run right there on the play, and it's third down and one, and Central Arkansas really picking up the base here. You're cheering for Central Arkansas. To me, it doesn't matter. I'm just here to call a college football game and kind of get in the flow of things for the college football season. Third down and one. Hands it off. Bouncing to the outside. Trying to get some. No. Cannot pick up the first down right there. Great stand right there by the Austin P defense. Wouldn't let him bounce out to the outside and wrap them up. It's fourth down and two. To me, it doesn't matter. Um, But... I, I, I would not care who wins this game, man. I, I just hope it, it's a close one, to be honest with you, man. But to me, it doesn't matter too much here. But I'm just kind of getting to the flow of things with college football. We're going to be doing these all football seasons. So I wanted to practice with it for um, yes, with the first game of the season. Drops back, fourth and two. They're going for it again. Under pressure. Scrambles, looks to the right side. And a tough play right there. And it's incomplete. He dove out for that one. And it's another turnover on downs for Central Arkansas. It, and they were past their 40 on both of those possessions. What a key stand right there. This Central Arkansas team has looked very aggressive. They've been trying for something. And great defense right there again. By Austin P, and it's going to be first down and ten for Central. I mean, sorry, it'll be first down and ten for Austin P here. They now take control of the ball at their own thirty-yard line, and they, and then they did go for it. And you know what? I I, I like it. Uh, you know what? I do like it. But I I mean, man, they are they are just struggling right now, man. They they really are. They just can't get any offensive rhythm going. Here we go, Austin P now. The same play though. Dish it over to Evans on the pitch. This time, Central Arkansas a little more prepared. Last time that play happened, they gave up a 75-yard rushing touchdown. Now they only give up two yards on the handoff to Evans Jr. Evans Jr., a freshman, and his first carry in his collegiate career, got a 75-yard rushing touchdown. 8.30 to go here in the first quarter of Football action here in the 2020 season. It'll be second down and eight here. Wide receiver in motion. You got Evans right behind the quarterback in shotgun formation. Second down and eight. Running back goes in motion to the left side. 
And now he's got to switch the play up here with the offensive lineman. Goes back on the shotgun. Seven seconds on the snap clock. Can I swing it over in the shotgun? Look, he fires over the middle and a risky pass, but it's going to be caught over the middle. And that's going to be good for about six yards short of the first down. And it'll go to third down and two. Third down and two here. Single season school record last season. Um, D'Angelo Wilson, 89 receptions. 1,564 receiving yards. He that led the FCS. He had 15 touchdowns and he averaged 104.3 yards a game. All right. So can you, man? They gotta speed this game. I, I feel like it's Austin PV is taking their good sweet time. They always wait till five remaining on the uh, on the snap clock right here. And again, five remaining. Third down and two. Big time play here. Tight end in motion. Two seconds, they get it off, they're going to hand it off up the middle, and he cannot get it. A great stand right there by the Central Arkansas defense, and it's going down the other way, and unless they go for it here, it'll be fourth down and one. Fourth down and one, and they need to punt this ball. If it wasn't so much backed up, no, they're going for it on fourth down and one. Fourth down and one. They're in the shotgun formation. They might just be trying to get them to draw off sides right here. 640 remaining here in this first quarter of basketball action. Here we go. Down in the shotgun. They are going to go for it here. And they, they are. They're going to hand it off and they get the first down up the middle. And that's Sneed right there. Brian Sneed powering his way through. It's first down. It's a first down right there for Austin P right there. And, and you know what? You know what? Both these teams have been so aggressive off the gates. But I mean, I mean, we've seen Central Arkansas go for it two times here, and now we've seen Austin P return the favor. But Austin P gets the first down. They've got it at their own 42-yard line. First down and ten here for Austin P. Here we go under the shotgun. You've got Brian Sneed behind him. He's gonna hand it off to Brian Sneed. Never mind. It's a play action. Bad pass and almost intercepted right there. Very, very risky pass right there. And just overshot him. It wasn't so much a risky pass. Just overshot him right there. Oh, man. Oh, man. I respect what you're doing. Keep it up. You Hopefully, I won't have to watch YouTube and the TV at the same. Yeah, I know. I get you, man. Do appreciate you stopping on into the stream, though, man. I, I know this one isn't as big of a game, but... Just, I'm just excited college football is back, man. I am, I am so pumped up. First down, a uh, second down and 10. I'm sorry. It is second down and 10 here for Austin Peavy. And he drops back on the shotgun throwing deep down the field. Does he have him? No. And that's going to be a pass interference. So on Central Arkansas. And honestly, I know we couldn't see it, but he really did not need to do that. That was going to be overthrown anyway. And instead, it'll now be first down and 10. And they'll have it around the year, the 45-yard line of Central Arkansas. I understood why he did it, but at the same time, I just don't think he was aware that that ball was way overthrown. It'll be a pass interference right there. And let's look. I mean, he just totally beats him, drops back. The safety goes in, and so he he's totally beat. But tough, tough luck right there. Welcome in. Uh, Nicholas, welcome on into the stream, man. I appreciate you tuning on in. Hope you guys are having a nice night. We got 20 people up in the chat. 551 remaining here in the first quarter. First down and 10 here after the pass interference on Central Arkansas. Austin Peavy with it at the at Central Arkansas's 43-yard line. In the shotgun, you've got Brian Sneed behind. Here we go. Here's the shotgun. He's going to hand it off up the middle. Now he fakes the handoff. Now the QB will keep it, and he's going to rush for about three yards on that play. It'll be second down and ten, a second down and around seven, I believe. I think he picked up around three yards on that play. Three or two, uh, no, he only picked up two yards on that play. It'll be second down and eight. Welcome in, Sam. You 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 got Austin PV. You got the Governors. Well, wait, we'll see, man. It's been a it's been a, a tightly game so far. It, it has been a good game so far, and Austin uh, P's offense have. The Governors have looked good so far here in this one. Second down and eight here and the shotgun formation. You've got three men behind him, though. Takes it in the shotgun here. Going to fake the handoff. Oh, another the fake pitch. And the quarterback going to keep it running up the middle again. And he can only fight for a couple yards on that one. It's going to be third down and seven. And this quarterback is known for he, – he's a good rusher, but – 
I, it's just been rough right now for him. He hasn't been able to find on those last two anything going. My money is on Austin plus five. Well, best of luck um, and on winning your uh, your bet. And he's got money line. So I know you guys want Austin P, P to win this game here. 435 winning here in the first quarter. It's third down and seven. They've got their ball at the, their Central Arkansas 39-yard line. Big time play here for Central Arkansas, but expect Austin P to go for it if they don't get it here today. Here we go. Here is the throw. They're going to throw it right up the middle, and it's incomplete. He dropped back in the pocket, had a man wide open, and he just drops it. And they're not so much in field goal range, so it's fourth down and seven. You got it at the Central Arkansas 39-yard line. You might as well just go for it right here. I don't see why you wouldn't, unless their field goal kicker can kick 56 yards. So that's that. That's my only thing with that one. What's up, man? I ended my stream. It wasn't doing as well as I thought. And I may go live again during the second half. But it, yeah, hey. Well, I appreciate you tuning on it. Uh, tuning on me, man. Hey, it's FCS, man. Look, mine isn't. You know, mine isn't doing the best. But now, you know what? Don't worry about the views, man. Views will come. Right, if you keep putting in the work, views will come. So, and another bad snap here on the punt, but they will get the punt off, and it's going to be a nice punt this time. Oh, but it takes a bad bounce. It bounced at the six-yard line originally, and then bounced all the way back to around the 15 where they downed it. So it'll be first down and 10 here for Central Arkansas when we get back from this commercial timeout. First down and 10 will come back with 4:07 to go here in the first quarter. Man, oh man, it's it's been a very entertaining game so far, man. It's just, I'm just so glad that football is back, man. I am so so glad, man. Good luck, bro. I I appreciate. Hey, best of luck on your bets, man. Best of luck on your bets, man. I don't do any sports, well, I, eh, a little bit, but best of luck on your guys' bets here today, man. Guys, make sure if you guys have not done so already, guys, smash up that like button, guys. Smash up the like button, guys. And if you guys are new to the channel as well, guys, smash up that subscribe button, guys. It really does help out with the channel. I know this is just an F FCS game right now, but I am going to be doing this type of content all college football season long, guys. I'm going to be doing this type of content all college football season long. I'm going to be doing it a ton. Four streams a day. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Four streams every single Saturday I will be doing here on the channel, man. So, hope you, if that is something you guys are into, man, smash up the like, hit that subscribe, and all that good stuff, man. That's what we call it. Play by play for college football, all college football season long. 7 to nothing. the score here with 404 here remaining in the first quarter. Austin PV up on Central Arkansas. It'll be Central Arkansas ball when we do return from the commercial timeout. Again, do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream. Yeah, man. I, I 10 people. Dang. It's crazy how soccer is more popular than, than football. What, what do you mean how soccer is more popular than football? I wouldn't necessarily agree with that that statement in, in such, but what do, what do you mean, bro? How? how? I, I mean, I, I, I wouldn't think so, man. I really wouldn't think. I really wouldn't think that's true, but... I, I mean, maybe over in England it is, obviously, but over here in America, it is definitely football the most popular. Nah, well, NBA is pretty popular, but it's starting to lose a little bit of interest from other people as well. So I would say football is definitely a more popular sport, but obviously that's just my opinion. Um, World Cup, that is true. That is, I'll give you that. That is true. On Labor Day at 8 p.m. Eastern time at around 7.50 is when I'll start the stream. I'll be covering... BYU and Navy, that'll be on Monday night, so hope you guys will join me in for that one, that should be a fun one, that will probably draw, draw in a bit, a bit more viewers here than uh, this one did, obviously it's an FCS game, just hoping to, you know, gain a few subscribers tonight, you know, who enjoy college football, and you know, we've got a good game going on right now here in this one, worldwide speaking, well yeah, worldwide speaking, but here in America, obviously, it, it's football, but Oh, worldwide, obviously, it is uh, soccer. There's no doubt about that one, Nicholas. First down and 10 here at their own 14-yard line. Central Arkansas backed up. Smith takes it out of the shotgun. Fake handoff right there. Throws it over the middle. It's deflected. Almost intercepted right there. Almost had it right there. Deflected right there by a linebacker up front. Let's watch this again. Fakes the handoff. A good deflection by the linebacker. If he would have just deflected that... A little more to the right. That probably would have been intercepted and headed the other way. It's now second down and 10. 
second down and 10 here. As he looks over for the play here, 4.02 here remaining in the first quarter. That's a new do, your, uh, your hair. Yes, it is, Brunson. It is a new do. I appreciate you tuning on, and he drops back in the pocket, throws for about three yards, and he is wrapped up right as soon as he catches the ball. He actually is going to pick up four yards on that play. It'll be third down and six. Third down and six upcoming, and they have got to get something going. I mean, they're 0 for 2 on third down so far, and they're 0 for 2 on fourth downs. Central Arkansas has got to get some offensive rhythm, and they've got to get it fast here. Third down and six here. Central Arkansas looking to get something going here and brewing. Out of the shotgun. Third and six. Fine, come on. And takes it. A draw play. Get a hand it off, and he's cranking some room on the left side. He's got around 20 yards. Breaks another tackle. That's going to be a first down. A big time play right there. They finally get a first down. And that, that's such a big play. Let's watch. Nice cut to the left side right there. And just totally breaks free. Gets all the way back to the 42 yard line. It'll be first down and 10. I'm doing well, Brunson. How are you doing? Fakes the handoff right there, throws over on the screen, and he drops the pass right there, and that's going to be second down and 10 now. And the thing about Central Arkansas and what I've noticed, they are, they, they are definitely one of those fast-paced offenses. They love, they, they love to work quick. They don't, they don't like to waste any time um, brewing. So second down and 10 here, 304 remaining here in the first quarter. Austin P up 7-0. Second down and 10 at the 43-yard line. They'll hand it off up the middle again. Finding some room, and he's going to get the first down unless they mark him a little bit short here. That was a nice run up the middle right there. I wish they had the names on the back of their jerseys for Central Arkansas, and they will. They give him the first down right there, and now quickly, here we go. They're already in the shotgun formation. Drops back under pressure, and he's going to move, trying to scramble away, and he's going to be ripped up for a two-yard loss right there on the sack. Beautiful job again. They are bringing tremendous pressure throughout this game. Just uh, it's coming from the left side of the floor right there. Just bringing the pressure within opens up a linebacker to then come up in through the hole. And they're really getting to this quarterback right now. It was only a one-yard loss. So you're doing a great job. Keep up the great work. Well, I do appreciate that, man. Do appreciate the support. Second down at 11. Takes it out of the shotgun here. Ball at the 47-yard line of Austin P. Drops back in the pocket. Fires over the middle. Got him in. He's going to get around seven yards over the middle. And that's going to cause another third down for uh, Central Arkansas. It will be third down and three. So a nice pick up there of eight yards. And that is something they really needed to do after losing a few yards on that sack. Third down and three. 153 to go here in the first quarter of action here. Ball at the 40-yard line. They've got to get to the 37. Takes it under the shotgun. I'm expecting a run. I'm expecting a draw play right here. And they will hand it up off the middle. And he stopped short again. Central Arkansas just cannot find a way. They just will not find a way. They're 0 for 2. They've gone for on fourth down twice already. Will they go for it again, or will they finally surrender and send out the punt team? It's looking like they are going for it once again, ladies and gentlemen. Fourth down and three coming up. They're 0 for 2 on first on fourth down so far, or 0 for 2. Yeah, they're 0 for 2. Here we go. Fourth down and three is in the shotgun. They're running back over to the right. He's switching up the play now at the offensive line. Here we go. Ten seconds remaining to get the snap off. Snaps it. Now it's going to be a pitch. Looking. Are they going to get it? The beautiful option play. Pitches it. And he's going to fight for the first down. And he gets it. Nice play right there. Beautiful play right there on the on the quarterback option right there. Pitches it right when he realizes that he's not going to be able to make it. And pitches off to the running back who does make it. And that will be a first down. And now here we go already. Back at it, man. I got to learn how to do this faster. Drops back in the pocket. Throws it. Tough play right there, man. Great defense. And that'll be second down and 10. Look for him on the right side. But, man, oh, man, has Central Arkansas been struggling on the pass? And you got to credit the defense of Austin Pay right now. 
He's rocking that on hey, I'm freeze hey, I'm a Spurs fan and a, and a Cowboys fan. However, I dig your enthusiasm and brought well, I appreciate that, Mike Perez. I do appreciate that, brother. 34 seconds to go in the first quarter. It is second down and 10 at the 32-yard line of Austin P. They'll hand it off up the middle looking for a hole. Can't find one. And this Austin P. defense won't let him go anywhere. And it's now third down and nine. Just gets one yard. And when and what has been the situation a lot here is they just have been forced with a lot of third down and longs, which is going to hurt. Big time in a game like this. Third down and nine. Eight seconds to go in the first quarter. They might just let it run out, and they will. That is going to end the first quarter of action here. We are going to quarter number two. Your score after one. It was the first play from scrimmage to start the college football season. It was a beautiful 75-yard run from Evans Jr. in his first run as a college player. 75 yards, and that's the only score so far that we have had in this game. We'll be back with the second quarter of basketball action here in just a little bit, guys. If you have not done so already, guys, smash up the like one, guys. Smash up the like one. And if you guys are new to the channel as well, hit that subscribe. And I know there's not too much people here tonight. It is a... Uh, it is a... Uh, Late, one, it's a, a later game, and at this, and also, it's, it's an FCS game, so I know not too many people are here for it, man, but hopefully you guys are enjoying the stream. If you are, smash up the like and hit that subscribe button, and guys, if you are new to the channel, may I ask you why you declined my trade on Fantasy? Brunson, I personally don't remember declining your trade on Fantasy. It depends on what it was. Um, if you offer me again, I'll, I'll, see, uh, I'll see what I can do, but... Uh, I, I, I'm in. I'm in it to win it, bro. But again, do appreciate everyone tuning in. Second quarter of basketball act or, or basketball action of college football will begin underway here in just a little bit. We are one quarter through through the first quarter of the entire 2020 college football season, and it, we've got many more to come here on the channel, man. Many, many more to come here today. What was your trade off? Yeah, it depends on what your trade offer was, because you know, obviously, I don't want to. I I ain't, I ain't accepting no bad trades, man. Come on, you already know I can't I can't be accepting any bad trades here. But again, do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream, guys. Really do appreciate it. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying. It was for net for C E H. I have no idea who C E H is. I have no idea. But second quarter of. Football action about to get underway here in just a little bit, guys. Just a little bit, man. They need to bring back college football video. Yeah, I wish they did, man. Mystery, you are absolutely right about that, man. They need to, to bring it back. They do. Uh, but that's only going to happen when college football allows them to benefit off their names and likely. Yeah, commercial break we're on right now. Um, the friend uh, Bray. Um, what's going on, though, man? I mean... It's it's been a struggling start so far for your offense right now. You guys really do need to to get something going here. You've got third and nine, and I just feel like you guys have been working your way into very bad third down situations here early in this game, which has caused you to go to fourth down a lot. And you guys are a very aggressive team, and you're going for it a lot. But I just you guys have got to you know get something going if you if if you know what I mean. Where's my water? Oh, there it is. All right. All righty, man, man. If Fournette doesn't break high ceiling, low floor, I, I don't, I, I don't know how I feel about Leonard Fournette, man. I really, I really don't. We got 17 in the chat. Make sure if you have not done so already, let me know in the comment section below your chin for it. If you're just joining us, we are in a commercial timeout right now. We're in a commercial timeout right now. Central Arkansas has the ball. It's third down and nine on their own end. Welcome back in, Nicholas. I appreciate you tuning on in. They've got it at their own 32-yard line. Third down and nine. Drops back in the pocket. Looking. Scrambling. Gets away from it. Throws it over the middle. It's intercepted. And here comes Austin Peavy. Breaks a tackle to the 40. And he's all the way down to the 46. And it's once again Austin Peavy with a great play right there. And what a terrible way to start the second quarter for Central Arkansas. And it's going down the other direction. It is now first down and 10. Now let's look. He scrambles away. Pressure has gotten to him today. And it was just a bad pass. And it was a fantastic read 
right there. And if they would have made one more block, if they if they would have been able to make one more one more block, he could have taken that one the distance. So big time play right there. And Nicholas is going well right now for Austin P right now, man. If you guys. You guys are looking good here. 1447 to go here in the second quarter as we just got back underway. What 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 a great what a great play right there. Austin P now with the ball at their own 43 yard line. And they'll take it out of the shotgun here. First down and 10. And is was there a flag on the play? There is. It's a delay of gain, so it'll be first down and 15. And and, and stuff like that. I mean, come on. Got to be aware, and you've got to know where you are in the game. You've got to use your head. It's just stuff like that, man. Hey, Sam, yeah, you guys are looking good so far, man. You guys are for sure looking good so far, man. First down and 15 now for Austin PV. They've got it now at their own 37-yard line. In the shotgun here on first down and 15. I wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't be surprised if they pass it. They do. Deep down the field. Got him in. And he's caught it. What a catch right there. And difficult defense. And yes, his feet were inbounds. And it's first down and 10. Just like that. And they've got the ball at around the 20-yard line now. Beautiful pass right there. And, and it could not have been placed better right there. They've gotten at the 21-yard line. Now they'll hand it off up the middle. Cuts to the left. Breaking tackles. Shane's on his feet. Are you serious? Spinning. No way. What a play right there. And he's going to break for about a 15-yard gain. And that's now first down and goal for Austin Peavy. I mean, first of all, what a catch right there on that last play. And then a beautiful hard-fought run right there. And now it's first down and goal at the 6-yard line. Offered you a different trade to you, chicken. All right, sounds good, man. Man, oh, man. Just, uh, that is fantastic, man. First down and goal is Austin Peavy. Looks to pull away with this. How about that defense? Austin Peavy plus the end is. Austin Peavy, Peavy plus five is looking nice right now. Austin Peavy is just dominating this game on both the offensive side of the ball and the defensive side of the ball, forcing turnovers or getting big plays. It has definitely been a fantastic game for them so far. First down and goal, and they are going to review this. Um, I'm not exactly for sure or sure exactly what. We are headed to a commercial timeout, though. So that's where we are going next. So we are in a commercial timeout. Again, do appreciate everyone stopping on into the stream, guys. Hope you are enjoying it, guys. I know not too many people in here tonight due to the fact that it is an FCS game, but I hope you guys are enjoying it, man. We are going to be covering some great college football games in the next couple of in the next couple of days on Thursday. We will be back Thursday. I will be doing either Central Arkansas versus UAB or Southern Alabama versus Southern Miss. Um, and then on Saturday, most likely Middle Tennessee versus Army, and then maybe SMU, uh, maybe another one later, but I'm not exactly sure. And then on Monday. The 7th, I'll be live for BYU and Navy at around 7.50 Eastern Time for that one. And then we go over to the following week. We look at sat, uh, week number two. Um, actually, yeah, hold on. Well, give me one. Well, actually, give me one second. Week number two looks like this. On Thursday, we'll do UAB versus Miami. And then Saturday, it's looking like we're going to do possibly... Um, Georgia Tech versus Florida State, and then followed along by so one other game that we will be doing on next weekend. So we'll we'll see what we'll see what happens. But tons of college football content here on this channel, man. So if you are new, smash the like, hit the subscribe button, guys. Let's try and get three new subscribers today. With all all I, if we got to two thousand two hundred, oh man, we keep losing, but. Let's just try and get five new subscribers to reach our goal, guys. Five new subscribers would be absolutely fantastic for an FCS football game. I would be thrilled with that. Not a fan of either of these teams, but I like chatting with you and seeing you bring the energy and make it in, making it entertaining. Well, I do appreciate that. And they are see they are reviewing to see if it was a catch. Did it get the elbow down? But they already ran a play, so how are they reviewing that? Wins the game approximately over my brain. Can't think. Uh, when's the game approximately over? Oh, man, I would say the game might end pro later tonight. And so they're going to – so 
what is happening? And so, okay, so there we go. So they called a whistle before the last run. So now it's going to be first down and goal. So 7 nothing the score here in this one. And I was confused on what the call was right there. It's actually not going to be first down and goal. It's going to be first down and 10. First down and 10 here at the... 11-yard line, I believe. Yes, at the 11-yard line. I'm not sure exactly what that was. And yes, Jazz Nuggets is tomorrow, man. Jazz Nuggets is tomorrow, man. All right. 13.56 to go here in the second quarter. They've got the first down and 10 at their uh, Central Arkansas 11-yard line. And the shotgun formation. They've got three running halfbacks behind them. He's going to hand it off up the middle. Brian Sneed. Man, I love that last name. Brian Sneed brings it up the middle. He picks up about two yards on that play. And it'll be second down and eight upcoming here for the Austin, for the Governors. That's what I'm going to start calling them. That's so much easier. It's so much easier to call them the Governors. So second down and eight here. 13-24 here remaining in the first and the second quarter. And I'm is did I say? Yeah, it is second down and seven. I'm sorry about that. Second down and seven here. 13-10 remaining here in the second quarter. Here we go. Austin P will take it on the shotgun. Hands it off up the middle to Brian Sneed. And Brian Sneed wrapped up after a gain of about one yard. It'll now be third down and six. A big time play right now for the Central Arkansas defense. To hold him to a field goal here would be really key. It, it is. It would be really key. You doing the Jazz game tomorrow? I hope so. Um, I, I should be able to, but... No, I, I'm not 100% sure, man. Third down and six here. 12.40 to go here in the second quarter. Central Arkansas looking to get something going right now. Or on the defense instead of the ball and get some momentum. And getting a stop right here would be really huge to that momentum. Third down and six. Takes the snap under the shotgun. Hands it off to Brian Sheen. Brian Sheen trying to bounce to the outside and gets met for a loss of four yards on that play. And it's now fourth down and 10, I believe. It might be fourth down and 11. A great play right there. They bounced right on him right there. And they totally expected the run to happen. I don't agree with running three straight plays in a row, but they do so. And it'll be fourth down and 10. And I believe the field goal crew will come on. They will. Man, I, and I am so sorry, guys. It was Austin Peavy's ball. If I ever do that, guys, just let me uh, let me know if I if I ever don't switch the ball so I can so you guys will know. Here's the a bad snap on the kick, but the kick is up and it's right down the middle. And Austin Peavy will extend to their seven nothing lead, ten to nothing the score here. Austin Peavy leads with eleven thirty eight to go here in the second quarter of action here. Austin Peavy looking good so far, and Central Arkansas needs to get something going, especially on the offensive side of the ball, man. They have got to get something rolling offensively, man, because they're, I wouldn't say running out of time, because that that is not the, that is not how you would put it, but they are, they are, they are not in the, they are not in the best shape right now on the, on the offensive side of the ball. So, Austin, Austin P, the Governors right now playing really good, so, we will see what happens, man, but we got 12 in the chat, man. Do appreciate everyone stopping on it. If you guys have not done so already, smash up the like. Hit that subscribe button if you are new, and don't forget to ring that notification bell, guys. Ring that notification bell, guys, so you never miss when we do go live here on the channel, man. I do appreciate everyone stopping in. Lakers 35-31 to 31 over the Trailblazers, and the Trailblazers without Dame. So, I mean, that series is all but over. I would be really, really surprised if... We saw a different outcome in this, uh, in in that game, and I, I really, I, I really would. I, I think that uh, Central Arkansas. I mean, sorry. I think the Lakers will, should be able to take that one pretty easily. So it'll be a kickoff here for Austin PV. Austin PV will kick it off to the Central Arkansas Bears. Here it's a ten nothing lead. The Governors just got a field goal just a second ago. We are on a commercial timeout. If you guys are just joining us here, that is where we are in the game right now. Commercial timeout. And what it, it's so it's so surreal, man. College football is actually back, guys. College football is here. As they're talking about Jeremiah talking about how important this is for, for college football to be back. 
Yeah, I know, man. I thought Central Arkansas was gonna get this one done, man, but it's not. It's not looking too good so far. Um, obviously, there's still plenty of time, plenty of time remaining here in this game. Um, but um, John, how are your Blazers? I know they were down four last time I checked, but how are they doing right now? What's going on, champs? Hey, champs. Well, best of luck to you guys tomorrow in the game, man. Best of luck to you guys, man. We got game number. Six tomorrow, man. So best of luck to you guys. Welcome on in. Hey, little easy. Welcome in, bro. Hey, yes, sir, man. Yes, sir. Welcome in, little easy. And so here comes the kickoff as Central Arkansas looking to change the tide a little bit here on this one. As it'll be booted away here. Or in just a second. Here we go in the kickoff. The refs are just waiting to blow the whistle here. Come on, any day now, bro. Come on. It's taking forever. It's a kickoff, man. And finally, they blow the whistle. And here we go. It's going to be kicked off. And this one is going to be way deep. And, yeah, that's going to go out of the end zone right there. And it will be a touchback. So it will be first down and 10 coming up here for Central Arkansas at the Austin P 20. Five yard line. They've got to get something going offensively here. It's pronounced Austin P. How do you, am I saying that right? Austin P. What's up, little man? You the man? I appreciate it, man. I appreciate. I appreciate you tuning in, Samuel. Austin P. That is that it. I'm I'm trying to get this right, man. Luckily, I won't have to stream that this team any much more. But first down and ten here at the 25 yard line for Central Arkansas. Bringing it out of the shotgun. And that's going to be a false start right there. Just miscommunication between the quarterback and the wide receiver right there. He jumps early. And it'll be first down and 15 right there. He jumped way early. Correct. All right. Austin P. Got it. Okay. Sounds good, man. Yo, uh, do you like Ohio State, Nate? Um, Actually, man, I'm a Michigan fan. Uh, Michigan is actually my second favorite team, so. Uh, not too much, no. Um, but uh, if Ohio State ends up having a season, um, I will be doing some Ohio State games. Here's the shotgun. Uh, Bart snaps it out of the shotgun. Going to do a little pitch forward. He's going to bring it up for about two yards right there. It'll be second down and 13. And for an offense that has been slow, I don't understand that play call at all. Uh, you have, They've have got to start moving the ball down the floor. I, I, or down the field. I, I, I cover so much basketball here on this channel. So if you ever hear me use a basketball analogy, that is why second down and 13 here at the 22-yard line. Takes it under the shotgun formation. Now drops back in the pocket looking. Throws over to the side. The tight end wide open. And he's got some room down the sideline. And he's going to get all the way to the 48-yard line. And knocks over something on the sideline right there. A beautiful play right there. He just... Totally slips right through the defense right there on that right side. And he gets some positive yards. It'll be first down and 10. First down and 10 here. 10.55 you're remaining in the second quarter. Do appreciate everyone tuning in. Hey, Nate. Hey. I, 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 I know you all better than us, though. I'll admit that. Here we go. Oh, man. Here drops back in the pocket. Going to throw it down the field. Oh, did he catch that in bounds? Did he catch it? No. He grabbed that behind. He grabbed it off of his back with one hand. Let's look at this again. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, that's close. I don't know about that one, man. He might not have gotten it, but a fantastic catch right there. Let's see. Oh. Oh, I don't know. Can I, I want to see a different angle on that. They're not going to review it. Second down and 10. Both the 49-yard line. Drops back in the pocket. Looking down the field. Now scrambling. Scrambling to the right. Throws it. And he's... Oh, another dropped wide open pass right there for Central Arkansas. And we wonder why they're struggling here in this one right now. That is the exact reason. And so, Nicholas, how NFL teams compare... Um, complain about the Redskins. Yeah, I, I, you know what? The Native Americans didn't mind it, so... The quarterback tonight for Central Arkansas, 56 yards, one interception, and six of 17 throwing so far. Third down and 10. Big play right here. 20 seconds to go to snap this one. Just they've got it. They've got to get a good play right now. They they really cannot afford to turn this ball over again. 
Here we go. Drops back in the pocket. Looking. Fires over the middle and got a receiver right up the middle in between two. I mean, in between four Austin P defenders. And it's going to be a first down. And that's such a big play right there. Takes his time. Finds the man over the middle. And he's swarmed by defenders. But it is first down and ten. Now. Here's again, out of the shotgun, going to hand it off up the middle on the draw, and he's going to pick up about one yard, maybe two here on that one. The Lakers, the next Yankees, and wait, the Yanker, the y Lakers, the next, the next, the Lakers and the Mets, Giants are all affordable. I have no idea what you're talking about, Mike. What, what do you mean, bro? I, I, I am really, I'm really confused, man. All righty. First down and uh, second down and nine. Second down and nine here coming up. Wide receiver in motion. Takes a hit, snap. Hands it off to the left side. Central Arkansas finding some room on that left side and runs for about eight yards. He's around one yard short. And part of me, he's going to be three, two yards short. It'll be third down and two. Coming up here for Central Arkansas. They are in field goal range, I believe, but they really need to start knocking on that end zone, man. They've got to get something going right now, something going positive in their favor. Third down and two. Such a big time play here on this one, man. I mean, this is this is such a big time play. All righty. So third down and two here for, uh, for Central Arkansas. Brings it up here at the gun. Looking back, he drops back, fires over the middle, got a receiver, spins out of a tackle, and then he's wrapped up at around the 20-yard line. And again, it's a first down right there. Fantastic play right there. Over the middle, and takes his time. And, and when he takes his time and he's got that offensive line protection, this quarterback is not bad at all. He can make some great throws. He's 4 of 6 for 53 yards on this drive. Swithin in the shotgun. Got the tight end in front of him. The halfback behind him. Going to hand it off to the running back. Trying to break free. Tries to break free on the left side. But he's wrapped down for a loss of one yard. It'll be second down and ten. Or second down and... Well, they don't even give him a, a one yard loss on that play. It'll be second down and ten here. 8.20 to go in the third and the second quarter. As this current drive right now for Central Arkansas, 9 plays, 56 yards, 3 minutes and 30 seconds. Here we go, Central Arkansas here in the shotgun. Looking to get something going here offensively. They've been very slow. They've got it at their at uh, Austin P 19-yard line. Nice pass over the middle right there. Breaks a tackle. Gets a few extra yards as he was falling to the floor. And it's going to be again third down. It's probably going to be around third down and two right there. A nice play right there over the middle. Or more on that left side, it'll be third down and three. I don't understand college football. Is it the same as? Yes, it is literally the same as the NFL, except it is college. That's literally all the difference is. Third down and three, and we are going to a commercial timeout. 7.39 remaining here in the second quarter of action here in this one. Third down and three. When we get back for Central Arkansas, and dang it, I got to remember to put that there. I got I I don't know why I forget. Oh man. Let's get let's get over 60 likes what I have, man. Hey, if you guys have not done so already, guys, smash up that like button, guys. Smash up the like button if you guys are new to the channel, guys. Hit that subscribe button. We're trying to gain around four new subscribers here by the stream. I know this is just an FCS stream, but let's try let's say let's at least try and gain a little bit, man. Yeah, I mean, I know, 10, 10 people in the chat. I, was, I wasn't expecting much for this stream, but I'm going to see it the whole way through, man. There's no there's no reason not to, so. All righty, man. Here we go, man. Again, commercial timeout right now on our hands right now. It is third down and three when we get back here for Central Arkansas. They've got the ball at the 19-yard line. They've got it at the 19-yard line. Alrighty, man. Do appreciate, though, everyone who is tuning on into the stream, guys. Make sure if you guys are still in the chat, comment down below. Get some conversation rolling in the chat. Trust me, I swear that during the regular season, the streams will be much more pop. The streams will be much more popping than this one. This is an FCS game, so I wasn't expecting too much. I'm not, I'm not going to lie, but I'm glad for those who can join me here today, man, and hope you guys are enjoying the stream. BYU Navy um, is probably, uh, unless I do the Army Middle Tennessee game, 
BYU Navy is looking like the next game that I will be covering here on my channel. That is the next game we'll be covering. That'll be on Monday. I haven't watched NFL since Super Bowl in the CFL till I got, uh, oh, really? Dang, bro. Hey, well, she get back into it, man. It's, it's, it's not bad at all. I'll tell you that much. It is not a bad sport at all. We got 11 in here. So it'll be third down and three here. 747 here remaining in the second quarter of action. Here we go. In the shotgun formation. Wide receiver goes in motion. He's got him. He throws to the left side, and that's going to be no pass interference called. The wide receiver cannot believe there was no call. And it goes down. Fourth down and three. And the field goal team is going to head on to the floor. The head coach is pissed off right now for Central Arkansas. And you know what? Let's see. Eh, I don't know. I, I, you know. I think that's a good no call. I think that's always a tough no call to make. But I do, I do in turn think that that was a... A good call. Here's the field goal. It's up. It's leaning to the left, but got it to go. And that will finally get Central Arkansas on the board here today. It is now 10 to 3. 737 remains here in the second quarter as Central Arkansas finally gets themselves on the scoreboard here today with the field goal. Again, they they could not put it in the you know the end zone, which which is which is key and, and which sucks, but for Central Arkansas, but only down seven here for as bad as they played. Not bad at all. Nathan Brown, third season at Central Arkansas as head coach. He's 15 and 9 overall. Welcome in Burnt. No, Ohio, Ohio State is the best. I truly believe if Ohio State would have played this season, um, if Ohio State would have played this season, I truly believe that the University of Ohio State would have won the College Football National Championship. I truly believe that. I truly believe that they would have been the best team in college football this year. And it sucks that they will not be able to uh, compete this year. It is now a kickoff underway here. A kickoff for Central Arkansas. Uh, Central Arkansas here will boot this one away to Austin P. As Austin P. looks to extend over this seven-point lead. Make sure, again, if you have not done so already, guys, smash the like. And if you are new to the channel and want more of these college football live streams, guys, Smash up that subscribe button as well, guys. It really does help out with the channel. 7.37 here remaining in the second quarter. As the kickoff is about to get underway. And it is boomed away right there. And it's going to be returned at the one-yard line. Bringing it up down the floor. Getting some room. And he's going to be wrapped up at around the 18-yard line right there. So, not that. You know, it was, it was okay return, but... I honestly would have probably just taken a, a touchback on that one. You had it. It was in the end zone where it picked up very short in the end zone. But now they're looking at a first down and 10 at the 18-yard line. So Austin P V looking or Austin P looking to keep their streak on offense going of scoring. And they've looked really nice so far on offense. And especially the quarterback, man, he has played a very, very nice role so far here in this one. 731 here remaining in the second quarter. Here we go. In the shotgun formation. Drops back in the pocket. Looking downfield. Fires it downfield. And a oh, it's almost intercepted. And then they'll call a flag instead. So from almost intercepted to then a defensive pass interference is what we're looking right there. But that was a great play right there to get up and, and almost intercept that one. But I believe they are going to call a defensive pass interference there. On that play, we are waiting on the official call from the referee. Make sure if you guys are just tuning in, smash up the like. And let me know who you guys are cheering for in the comment section below. And it will be a pass interference there on the defense. And there we go. It is Austin Peavy's ball right now, guys. It is Austin Peavy's ball. And let's. I want to see this again. That is not defensive pass interference at all. That 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 was a missed call right there. I will I will for sure say that. Robert Ro Rochelle, a senior, 44 tackles, 5 interceptions, and 18 passes defended last season. This year, he is a senior, so looking to go out on a bang here. As it is first down and 10, they've got it at the, their own 33-yard line right here. Here we go. 
Move, move the football. Thank you. Yeah, I, I just moved it, man. There we go. Hands it off. Now, making some cuts. And Brian is met right there. He only picks up around two yards right there. It'll be second down and eight off the handoff right there. And early in this game, the running really worked for Austin P. But so uh, ever since that one, that 75-yard rush touchdown and then the couple rushes later on, they have really been limited on the rush. But 80 yards so far for TJ Evans Jr. tonight with that, obviously with that 75 yard uh, rushing touchdown to start us off here. Austin PV here working with it at second down and seven. And the shotgun will send the wide receiver in motion on the right side. Takes it under the shotgun formation. Now looks to switch up the play a little bit. One on the, they got to snap it. They do. And no, they will not. They blow the play dead, and that is once again going to be a delay of gain on Austin Peavy. That's their second one of the game so far of just not being able to just not being able to get the snap off. And they did that earlier today, and that, and that stuff like that, you guys can – it's simple mistakes. It is simple mistakes that you have got to be able to work and fix on, and, and they just have not been doing that right now. So – Tough luck right there, but it is now second down and 12 here for Austin Peavy. We got 6.15 to go here in the second quarter. Austin Peavy looking to get something going here again on offense. They've looked good on offense so far here in this one. They're going to hand it off up the middle. Now makes a cut on the right side. Another cut, and he's going to pick up about six yards on that handoff. It's now going to be third down and six. A nice run right there up the middle. Got half those yards back that they did just lose. It'll be third down and six here. A big time play. You don't want to give Central, you know, Arkansas any momentum here. You know, you give, you know, you punt the ball and then Central Arkansas gets a touchdown and it's 10 to 10. You've dominated this first half, but, you know, simple as not scoring or, or giving the ball up too soon here on this possession could be costly. Third down and five here. They're in the shotgun formation. Here we go. Brings it. Fakes the handoff under tons of pressure. Scrambles to the right now. Throws over the middle. And it's incomplete. And that'll force fourth down right there. Great defense once again right there from Central Arkansas. And they force fourth down. Great pressure on the quarterback right there. He forces. They force that bad throw. If the quarterback is balanced, he's probably able to make that throw right there. But great job to bring pressure right away. And cause the punt team to come out now with 521 remaining in the second quarter. And if you're Central Arkansas, you've got to be feeling good now. You've got a chance to tie this game up before the halftime. I mean, someone someone trolled before the uh, someone trolled before the stream, man. Someone trolled before the stream, man. But I do appreciate you stopping in, man. Welcome in the mini mama, man. I do appreciate you stopping in. That's another bad punt. They've done it again. Are you serious? And this time, the punter is tackled at the 11-yard line. Are you serious? And it's first down and 10. <laughs> Are you serious? Wow. And just like that, all the momentum to Central Arkansas. That's the second bad snap. <laughs> I can't even take it seriously. I, I can't. I, I, another bad snap right there. And now Central Arkansas takes over at the 11 yard line <laughs> look at that man and now central arkansas just like this can tie this game up just just like that it, it's that it's that they're they're that close now first down and 10 at the 11 yard line for the they'll throw it right in the end zone and he overshoots them and it goes to second down and 10. Look for the receiver there on the left side. of me. that was William or Williamson um, right there. And it was a tough play. If he makes it, you know what? That pass is just too far. If that pass is on target right there, that is in the back of the end zone. Could not find his target. It'll be second down and 10. I know, man. They did it before. The, I, don't, I don't know who did that, man, but. Second down and 10 here. Central Arkansas, you have got to put this one in the back of the end zone. No excuses here. Second down and 10. Wide receiver in motion. They'll hand it off on the middle. Looking for a hole, and they can only pick up three yards on this one. And now it's going down to third down and 10. And, and this is and this is where if you're Austin Peavy and you can stop, hold them to a field goal right here, that is a win. 
That is an absolute win. If you're Austin PV and if you're Central, if you're Central Arkansas, you've just got to find a way to punch this one in the end zone, man. I, I mean, there is no excuses at all. Not none, none at all. Ten to three, the score here in this one. <clears throat> Four thirty-five to go in the second quarter. Third down and seven. Takes the snap under the shotgun. Here we go. Drops back in the pocket, looking, scrambling, gotta get away, and he's shifted behind the line. Oh, and how about that? What a stand by the Austin P defense. It is fourth down and eight. What a terrible play. But oh, they get the ball at the 11 yard line. At the 11 yard line. And they have to settle for a field goal. Fourth down and eight. The field goal team will come on. They're looking to make this a four point game. It's a 26 yard attempt, but the angle is not good. It's up, and the kick is away, and it is good, and it was good by a mile. 10 to 6 to score now as we are, we've got 351 here remaining in the second quarter. No, no, Pickle Man, there are fans. There are some fans in the stadium, man. There are some fans in that stadium. But, it, you know, it, it definitely doesn't feel the same, man. I, I, I'll say that much for sure. It, it does not, it, do, it doesn't feel the same, man. But 10 to 6 to score, Austin PV, or Austin P, I'm sorry. Looking to come back into this one, man. Do appreciate everyone stopping on in, guys. Again, if you have not done so already, guys, smash the like. Hit that subscribe button, of course, if you guys are new to the channel, guys. I don't, I don't even know if we have, um, uh, I, to be honest, I don't even remember the last time that, um, I totally forgot what I was going to say, but 13 people in the chat. I do appreciate everyone tuning in. 10 to 6 to score. And it was a big, big, big. Just, it was, it was t terrible news. Uh, I mean, not terrible news, but terrible for Central Arkansas. They took over possession at the 11 yard line. They took over at the 11 yard line and could not find their way into the end zone. Instead, they had to kick a field goal. Instead, it is 10 to 6. Yeah, there's people in the, in the, in the stadium right now, Pickle Man. No, no, there's actually a decent amount for an FCS game. It's it's actually probably like a normal crowd. So, and, and but I mean, it, it is how it is, man. At least there's some fans, right? At least there's some fans in attendance for this one, man. 10 to 6 to score here in this one. Austin P up right now, 10 to 6, as it'll be a kickoff here for Central Arkansas. As they will boot it away now to Austin P as Austin P. Austin P's got to get a new snapper or a, a new long snapper because Austin P's long snapper has had two big time mistakes here or in this game so far. 3.51 to go here in the second quarter. Here we go. So the kickoff about to get away. If you guys have not already, let me know in the comment section below who you guys are cheering for in this game. Let me guys, let me know in the comment section below, guys. Do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream. And it is booted away, and the kickoff is going to be way short. Caught at the 11-yard line, and now he's going to break free, and he's going to get to around the 22-yard line, I would say, right there. And so it's now going over to the Austin P's, Austin P's ball right here as we are closing on the last couple minutes of the first quarter of basketball action here, or basketball action, of football here in this one, man. What's going on the LEGO Republic, man? Welcome into the stream, man. Make sure as you do come in, man, smash up the like, brother. Smash up that like as you do come in. 10 to 6 to score here. 346 remaining here in the second quarter. 10 to 6 to score here for Austin P. Or Austin P. Man, I, I gotta learn to get that name right. Here we go. First down and 10 here, over under the shotgun here, is Austin P as they look to start this one, as they're going to look back in the pocket, they're going to pitch it right away, and only can get three yards there, and it's going to go to second down, oh, I did not even finish the thing, it's going to be second down and seven here for that one, you know what, it's just mediocre right now. We saw the explosiveness of Austin P early in this one, but ever since then, it has been slow. It, 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 they, they really have just been slow. 3.20 to go here in the second quarter. Second down and seven. And Austin P out of the shotgun formation here looking to get something going. Four-man blitz coming here for Central Arkansas. 
Here we go. They're going to fake the handoff. Never mind. They will hand it off. And it's going to be. They're going to be wrapped up there for only a gain of two yards on that play. And now it is third down and five. And a, a night. And you know what? You know what? If I'm Central Arkansas, I call a timeout right here. I call a timeout because if you're going to stop, Central Arkansas can now go up at halftime. Addison, check your text for me. I absolutely will after the stream, man. Yeah, the Blazers are playing well, man. They really are. We got 20 people in the house now. Let's go, man. I appreciate everyone stopping on in, man. Smash up that like, guys. Let's go. Here we go. Third down and five under the shotgun. Austin P needs a first down. Running back in motion. Switches over to the right side to the left side. Takes a snap under the gun. Blitz. A hard blitz. And he's going to be wrapped up. Never mind. He breaks away from it. Scrambling. And he's going to pitch it forward. He got it. And he's going to break free. Here he goes. The 40. The 45. 50. And he's going to step out of bounds at the 49-yard line. And it's a first down. From disaster to an amazing play right there. We see the heavy blitz coming. I saw it right before. He scrambled away. He just pitched it. And then nobody was there on that right side, and he was just able to break free. Such a big-time play, and that's first down and 10. What a play right there for, for Austin P. and that could really swing the momentum here in this second half. Wow, that is such a key play. Now they have the, the Central Arkansas 49-yard line with a minute 40 to go here in the second quarter. Here we go. Brings it under the shotgun. Fake pass. Now looking, scrambling, and he's going to get some room. Breaking to the right side. What a block. And he's going to get around 17 yards. What a block by the tight end right there. Let's look at this one again. He fakes the pass, and he's just going to scramble away, and then just boom. And then he got a beautiful block where he just hit the right right side. And another first down. It's 10-6 to six to score. We've got 124. Never mind. I take it back. There is a foul right there. Or not a foul. There is a uh, flag on the play. There is a flag on the play. Is this a new football? No, it's FCS. Um, Basically, it's a lower. Like, we're in FCS. This is uh, uh BYU is in FBS. Um, we are. Uh, they are in FCS. Oh, and that's a targeting. They're going to call a targeting here on this play. That's what the call is going to be here. So scratch anything with the first down right here. Or no, they call it a blindside block rule. It looked like a targeting. That really did look like a targeting on that one, man. And they're not going to call the targeting. So instead, it's going to be first down and 25, maybe? First down and 17. Here we go. And they're going to fumble the ball. And it's picked up by Central Arkansas. They pitched it backwards, and they fumbled it on the pitch, and Central Arkansas picks it up. What a momentum swing, and it's now first down and 10, and Central Arkansas with great field position, and can now take the lead going into halftime. Wow. And let's look at this again. Takes it, and look, it's just a simple pitch, but he slipped while pitching it, and then it was picked up. And if Central Arkansas didn't slip while they were picking it up, he could have taken that one all the way back to the house. Wow. And just like that, all the momentum here in this game has shifted. Just like that. I'm not acting like, no, I'm not acting, no, I'm not saying, no. Basically, he, he just didn't, uh, he, um, Kanan, wait, he didn't understand what the FCS was. That's all. Um, his team is in the FBS. Here we go. Smith rolls down the pocket. Fire to the right side. And that is intercepted. And just like that, the momentum right back in Austin Peavy's hand. Or Austin Peavy's hand. Wow. Just like that after a costly turnover. And Central Arkansas blows a fantastic chance. And Austin P takes the ball. One away remaining in the second quarter. Hey, man. what? I mean, no. Well, someone trolled before the beginning of the stream, and that that they there was a fa there was a penalty call for a legal man down the field, but it was obviously declined. And what a bad mistake right there by the quarterback! And let's look at this play again. It was a nice play to roll out in the pocket, and he had him right there, but just made a poor pass. Tried to fire it into the back of the end zone, didn't get the pass high enough. 
But yeah, no, all I was saying, man, is he didn't understand what the FCS was, man. That's all it was. And so, man, man, what a big momentum shift. And now Austin Peavy with the, with 108 here remaining in the second quarter. They're up by four. If you guys have not done so already, guys, smash the like. And if you guys are new to the channel, guys, hit that subscribe button, guys. It really does help out with the channel, guys. We're going to be doing this type of content all, all uh, college football season long. 105, 108 to go here in this uh, second quarter. And we are oh, we are almost at halftime here. All right, here we go. First down and 10. They're going to hand it off up the middle. It breaks free for about four to five yards. Then you got four yards on that play. And it will go to second down and six right there. And, and we just, on back-to-back -back play, two turnovers. And, you know, both these teams have been playing extremely sloppy here today. Extremely sloppy game of football here today. But, you know, it, you know it's rusty. We're playing through a national pandemic right now. First game for both these teams. And, oh, wow, the Lakers and Blazers are tied at halftime. I did not see that one, man. Um, I hope to stream some NBA tomorrow, man. Um, I should be able to, but I, I am not sure, man. I do appreciate whoever subscribed, man. Let's try and get three new subscribers by the end of the stream, guys. I'm Let's try and get three new subscribers. That is going to be our goal, man. If we get three new subscribers, man, I'm going to be hyped, bro. I'm going to be hyped because five subscribers, it's not, you know, it might not seem like a lot, but, what, you know, not a lot of my subscribers are into college football. So, trying to build that college football base this season because I'm going to be doing college football all season long, man. All season long, man. What did uh, Keenan say? Uh, Keenan just said, um, you're acting like the FCS is bad. That's all, man. Nothing bad. Welcome in, Omen Paddle. Welcome into the stream. 53 seconds ago, your second down and seven. Takes it out of the shotgun here. Going to hand it off. Noah Fake now pitches it again. Looking to hit that corner. Oh, and it's, oh, what a hit. Oh, baby. Oh, get it in his grill and sit him down. Holy crap, he just sent him back to last season. Holy cow, what a hit. Just throw him on the left side and boom, lowers the shoulder. He fumbled the ball, but it did go out of bounds. What a hit right there. And it'll be third down and three upcoming. A big play, 42 seconds to go. And if you're Central Arkansas and you get a stop here, you call timeout. If you, and then, you know, you, you've got to try and make a push. Monday, are you going to be doing a Yes, Wyatt Powers, I will be doing BYU versus Navy on Monday. Yeah, I'm going to be doing the exact same thing doing here, calling the live play-by-play -play reaction for BYU and Navy starting at 7.50 Eastern time here. I got to go. I hope you have a great stream. Thank you, man. I appreciate it, man. Thank you for stopping in. Hope you have a great rest of your night. But yes, I will be streaming the BYU-Navy game on Monday night on Labor Day. So hope to see you in there. We've got around 40 seconds to go. A timeout was called by Austin Peavy. Third, third down and three when we do come back. This game will end around 12 or 1 a.m. Yeah, man, I'm staying up late here to do this game for you guys today, man, because I know not everyone has access to it. And you know what? I'm, I'm so excited for college football. So that is that is probably the main reason why I am doing this. So. But I also love hanging out with my subscribers, man. Does mean a lot. So, here we go. They're going to do another pitch play, and they're not going to get it. And Central Arkansas call timeout because it's now going to be fourth down and four. And they will. They're going to call timeout right here, a smart play, and they're going to force them to punt it. Fourth down and four. And that, that is smart, smart plays. And they're not commonly known college, uh, college teams. Uh, that BYU will be, yes. Yes, that be, yeah. And, 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 but, but um, Vintage, I'm not mad. That ten, 10 people for me. Like, to me, the, here, here's my thing. I don't care about the views. Views, if we had one person in here and they were interacting in the chat, I'd be fine. Views mean nothing to me. Obviously, I love having people in here. That's, that's what, what makes it great. But, but it, you know, the views will come if you put in the work. And I, you know what? I've gained two subscribers tonight, too. I'm probably going to stream this game for four hours and gain two subscribers. But it's two more subscribers that I didn't have before. So that, that's kind of how I look at it, man. But yeah, that game will for sure be better. BYU Navy, two more known football teams. So that's that's a definitely going to be a better game. Welcome in, Bill. Welcome into the stream, man. Hey, you know what? It was 10-6. It was 10 nothing earlier. And now it's 10-6. Bill, you are still in this game, man. Welcome into the stream. Hope you're having a fantastic night. And best of luck to your Central Arkansas Bears. 
Bro, what up with it? It's like somebody trolled before the uh, the stream. That's all. Somebody was just trolling. All right, fourth down and three. They're going to punt this one away, and they're going to down them right here. Oh, a beautiful punt. That's going to go down and roll to the 26-yard line. And now with 36 seconds, does Central Arkansas make a push here? They've got two. No, they've got no timeouts. No timeouts with 36 seconds to go. But remember, in the in college football, the um the clock will stop here on a first down. So the clock will stop on a first down here. So right here, you've got to throw the ball here. Throw the ball. Get some first downs here. Get in the field goal range. Don't go for the touchdown. Get in the field goal range. Get into a spot. You were down 10 nothing here earlier in this game. To go down 10-6 to is fine. 10-9 to at halftime, I'm feeling fantastic if I'm Central Arkansas. Keep in mind, Central Arkansas does get the ball to start the second half. All righty. And I, hey, and I do appreciate that, White Powers. I really do appreciate that. Just so you know, we don't only cover college football. We co cover NFL here on the channel. We also cover um, MLB, NBA, MLB, college basketball, all that good stuff, man. So really do appreciate that, man. It means a lot. And, and a terrible start right there to their run here. 33 seconds and right away on the snap. I believe that's going to be a delay of gain. And I've been talking about this all game long because we have seen so many Delay of games here in it to you know to start this game, and I know there's a lot of rust here, but that's four delay of games, two for each team. Simple mistakes are killing them. I've seen some of your NBA teams get over 400 in the fourth. Uh, in the fourth, the college, uh, the college games will later pick up more strength. Yeah, absolutely, man. I'm not worried about it, man. Not worried about it at all. All righty, here we go. And this shotgun right here. He's going to look. Smith out in the pocket. Rolling. He's going to throw it deep. And it's going to be incomplete. First down and 15. Cannot get that one to fall right there. It's now second down and 15. 34 seconds. But a, but a smart play right there. Don't risk it. They did not throw it anywhere where where Austin P or Austin P could catch that ball. And they threw it towards the sideline. Because with no time, you're really going to need to get out of bounds. Second down at 15, 34 seconds. They got them off the 21-yard line. Here we go. Throws it over to the side. A nice screen pass. Getting some blockers. And they're going to skate to the outside. And he steps out of bounds. With 27 seconds to go, it'll be third down. And around 10, I believe. Third down and 10. And that's what it looks like here. We're about to see, though. Third down and 10 is correct. I am watching the game on YouTube on my laptop or watching you on the phone. Well, I appreciate that, man. Oh, glad you are enjoying the commentary. 27 seconds to go here in half number one. Here we go. They're only bringing a three-man. Now they're going to run the ball. And a very surprising call right there. And that's going to call for a fourth down in around seven. And they might just let this clock run down. No, in Central, no Austin P now calls a timeout. So Austin P will now call the time. Oh, voice crack. Dang, bro. Man, oh my. Fourth down and seven. The call. Oh, fourth down and seven right now is what we're looking at. And that is just poor, 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 poor decision right there. It was a bad drive. And then that, that's what it was. But still plenty of time. And Central Arkansas will get the ball. Central Arkansas will get the ball to start us off here um, in the second half. When we do get there. But there are still 20 seconds. You got? Do you know... It's uh, it's start. They had to do the Braves game today. Did you know it start that? I, I what do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Uh, White Powers. Oh, I have a lot of dislikes. Some people just don't read the title. Um, yeah. Some some guy. Well, it, it wasn't even that. Some guy trolled me before the stream, like before it even started. So fourth down and eight, and the punt team is coming on. I'm just gonna leave it at fourth down and seven. I don't feel like changing it. Fourth down and eight, right here. Has a punt team coming on. They need a good punt. Pin them deep. If you pin them deep, if you have a good punt and pin them deep, they're probably just going to knee and send this one to halftime. So fourth down and eight. And the punt is up and a good punt right there. Or maybe not so. It's a fair catch at the 35-yard line here. So it'll be first down and 10 for Austin P here. And it'll be interesting to see what they can do. Here, I, I, if I'm the coach, I'm taking the 10 nothing lead here at halftime. You've got one more timeout. Maybe, you know what, actually, you know what I'm going to do here? What I would do is I actually throw, 
deep here. You've got 12 seconds, right? I say you throw deep and you try and get in field goal range, honestly. That's what I would do. Is it is it raining in the in the stadium? I don't think it is, but am I, oh I can't really tell from where it is, but it is looking like they're just going to go down and take a knee. And they will. And we are going to halftime, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to halftime. Your score, 10 to 6. Austin P on top. And Central Arkansas will receive the second half kickoff. Wish this game was playing in Conway. Is Conway where the uh, Central um, Arkansas? Because I looked at that stadium, and you know what? I really do like that stadium, Bill. Bill, I, you know, I, I was looking up some pictures earlier, and I, I, that stadium, that stadium was pretty sick, dude. I'll give you that much. Like, that, that stadium was, I, I really, really enjoy, like, looking, like, it, it seemed like a dope stadium. So, I, that, that was just, that's just my take on it. Um, let's see some NBA scores going on right now. I know there's one other one going on. That's tied at halftime. Yeah, no, isn't that what, like, let me look at I'm going to look up Conway Stadium because that was the one with that beautiful purple field. Like with the gray and purple field. I I love that one. Um, I'm just going to, I actually have a picture of it on my computer, but yeah, man, uh, that is, man. You know, it's the purple one, right? Yeah. It, yeah, I mean, that that is, or is it a state stadium? Right? Yeah. Yep, Central Arkansas Bears. Um, first security. Yeah, with the purple and gray stripes, dude. That is so dope, man. It really is. We are at halftime for anybody just joining us in here today, man. Do a pre up the stripes, uh, Cannon Wade. Yeah, man. You know, I, I saw that earlier today and I go, you know, that's an underrated field concept. And I and you know, obviously it doesn't get as much hype because it's in the FCS, you know, because Boise State, you know, with their blue stadium. Uh, with, not Blue Stadium, but their Blue Field, you know, they get a lot of hype for that, but, I, you know, I really like that stadium, dude. Like, that is not a bad stadium at all, dude. Like, I, with the stripes and everything. That is actually really cool, man. I, I'll give them that much. If there was a Pac-12 game, the score would at least be 21-13. to 13. Yeah, well, man, Pac-12 games are fun, but, you, you know what, you know, it's, and you have to understand, I think a lot of these first games that we're seeing here, are going to be low scoring just in general to start the college football season because offensive offenses are rusty and you know the like for example I'm going to break down stuff that happened here at halftime you had Austin PV who had two snaps that went behind the punter one which ended up leading to an uh central uh Arkansas field goal and then the other one which just led him to great field position which led him to the field goal you've had then that Interception, um, to, well, two interceptions have uh, that Austin P has intercepted. They've they've been playing really good on the defensive side, and the one in the end zone that was key to uh, keep on to a uh, to keep on to the lead here. Otherwise, Central Arkansas would be up thirteen to ten right now. And then you've got you know the 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 fumble on that on that pitch. Both teams are sloppy right now, but keep in mind it's been over two hundred fifty days for most of these teams since they have played a game of football. So it, they're going to be a little rough, and, and and that's and I'm expecting that. So I did um the per, uh, got an Instagram. Yes, I do have an Instagram. If you guys do want to go follow me over on Instagram, um, and you guys can always DM me. DMs are always open. That is my Instagram. If you guys do want to go follow me, uh, Boise Blue is so it is man. I have to go to that stadium one time, man. Before I before I pass, man, that is a must see. A must-see stadium over there in uh, Boise, man. I, I absolutely love that stadium. Never been, just seen it. You know, obviously in pictures, but I I do absolutely love it. I'm not sure if I like that stadium. Really, well, I, I just like it because it's different, and, it, and it's so unique. I just love that. I just love it, dude. I, I really do. There's something There's something else about it, man. The Oregon Nuts basketball court has the trees all over. I, I, love Oregon, I love Oregon's uniforms. I think everyone can agree on that. Oregon's uniforms are dope. Uh, I mean, it doesn't get much better than Oregon uniforms. Uh, they, you know, they've been a little uh, slacking the past couple of years. I will say that, but man, Oregon's uniforms—they're always see. You, you know, you're you're never disappointed with them. I mean, I, I absolutely love the. Uh, I I love the Oregon uniforms personally, um, and I obviously know that you're a big uh, Oregon fan. I would have done Oregon Ohio State, but we all know how that ended up. Vintage, uh, vintage—that's actually pretty dope. 
Hey, hey, it is, man. Um, we all love it, but everyone else hates it, just like boys. Yeah, but hey, I it is. It's actually pretty cool, man. You know, a lot of these teams have underrated designs, man. If you guys have not done so already, though, guys, make sure to smash up that like button, guys. Smash up the like button. We are still. Uh, I think we're three, two subscribers away from our goal. So if you guys are new and you're enjoying what you're seeing, hit that subscribe button. I will be live once again. Let me read you all my schedule since we are at halftime. So with so and for next week on September third, I might uh, probably not. I'm not gonna be live until Saturday. For I'll be live for one game on Saturday, either Middle Tennessee versus Army. Or Arkansas State and Memphis. One of the two I will be live for to on Saturday, the September 5th. And then on Monday, on Labor Day, come spend Labor Day here. Night at Labor Day with some college football. We've got BYU. We've got Navy. It's going to be a fun time, man. So I hope you guys will will tune in and, and, and tune into those streams, man. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notifications so you guys never miss when we do go live for the uh, for college football, man. So, okay, I do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream. Uh, freshest shooting's in the game. Yeah, they do, man. You guys really do. Now, Juicy would be up 50. What, what do you mean, mystery? What do you mean, brother? All righty, man. Do again. Appreciate everyone stopping in. Keep smashing the like, guys. Let's keep it going. Chris Cole, just follow me on Instagram. I assume that's somebody I just uh, gave it to, so I will go follow you back on the IG. Uh, Wolves up. Yes, sir. Hey, we'll see what they can do, man. Um, Bill, if you don't mind me asking, um, how are you, uh, Central Arkansas? Are you a grad there? Are you, uh, are you from Central Arkansas? Or how's that work? I'm just curious to, to see, you know, how you're, or how you became a fan of, uh, Central Arkansas. As we are at halftime right now, uh, the Big Ten is a developing story considering starting Thanksgiving weekend. Why? Why? Why start two weeks? Why start two months later? For what purpose? I, I genuinely don't even get that. That that is so dumb. That that is so dumb. I go to Arkansas State. You go to Arkansas State, and so you're cheering for Central. Ar okay, okay. So you just support Central Arkansas because they're from Arkansas, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, yeah. You cheer on all Arkansas. Okay, I get that. I get that, man. So the preseason AP College Top uh, fo uh, Football Bowl, you've got number one, Clemson, number two, Ohio State, three, Alabama, four, Georgia, five, Oklahoma, six, LSU, seven, Penn State, um, nine was Oregon, and ten was Notre Dame, and LSU was eight. And actually, my favorite team, USF, actually just scheduled Notre Dame on the road. So if Notre Dame does allow fans, I will be live. I won't be live, but I will be at the USF Notre Dame game on September nineteenth. Yeah, so you know, you know what? That's fair, man. I, you know, I catch myself supporting some Florida teams all the time too, since I, that is where I um, am from. Holy crap, man! It is ten forty-six. Halftime should be getting wrapped up here in just a little bit, guys. Appreciate everyone again stabbing on into the stream, man. Man, it should be a good second half. It really should be. I'm, I'm excited to see what happened. Penn, you're a Penn State fan, Wyatt. Hey, man, well, if Penn State does end up starting their season, don't you worry, man. Tons of Penn State live streams, man. I do it, and it sucks. I'm going to be doing tons of SEC, and obviously I'm going to be doing tons of all teams, but I'm going to be doing tons and tons of Big Ten when that does get back. I, I really am, and I'm an Alabama fan. Okay. You're in Alabama. I can respect that. I will be doing some Alabama games throughout the season as well. I don't do just FCS, obviously. I do a ton of college football stuff on this channel. Again, um, on, uh, I mean, I'm going to be, uh, well, let me look at Alabama's schedule. I can tell you some games I'll be doing. Alabama football schedule. And, I, and I, I, if they're playing like LSU or Florida, you already know most streams will be popping. I know there's 13 people in here today, but those streams, those will draw well. When they play Texas A&M on October 3rd, you best believe I'll be live. Georgia, and when they play LSU, Auburn, oh, man, it's going to be dope. It's going to be dope, but I'm going to be covering tons of content here on this channel, man, for college football. I also do NBA, NFL. Uh, college basketball, MLB, stuff like that, man. So that is something you guys are into. Hit that like and subscribe. We're trying to reach 2,285 subscribers, guys. So let's try and get that one 
But let's try and reach that goal here today, guys. Arkansas has a ridiculous schedule. Well, they're in the SEC, and with how, you know, I, I don't mean to be rude. And I'm not, well, be rude or, you know, throw your team under the bus. But Arkansas, obviously not the best team. They did improve last year, uh, but they're, they're in the SEC. So that schedule is going to be brutal, obviously. Um, Spencer Rattler should be good. I'm sure. Oh, I hope we beat Ohio State. Well, why you guys aren't playing right now? Um, the Big Ten is not um on is, the Big Ten is not playing, and I mean they are just straight up not playing. Um, they're thinking about maybe going back Thanksgiving break, and if they do, you best believe we'll be live for Penn State, Michigan, Michigan State, and Ohio State all the time. Welcome in Yolo Bozo. Welcome on into the stream. I appreciate you stopping on in. I'm back. Welcome in Wakanda forever. Um, nine of the ten teams were bowl eligible this year. Seven, ten are ranked. Four, ten ranked top ten. Yeah, you, you're right. You know, you just aren't the best team. And when you play in the SEC, that that's what's gonna happen, man. I mean, you guys, you guys have a brutal schedule. You guys do. I mean, it, it is as it is as simple as that. You guys have a brutal schedule, I, and it sucks. It does, but man, oh man. South Carolina plays LSU. Hey, right, man, I'm going to be doing any games that you guys want me to do. Comment down. Literally comment down and I should be able to do the game. You guys, like, I'm going to be spending my entire so Like, it is my dream to become an announcer, whether it's for college football, MLB, NBA, whatever it is. And that's why I run this channel because that is my dream. It's been my dream since I was eight years old. So, on Saturday, there will be a 12 o'clock game. A 3.30 game, a 7 o'clock game, and a 10 o'clock game. I will be live from 11, I know, I will be live from probably on Saturdays, 9 a.m. to 1 a.m. in the next morning. Because I'll be covering college game day. Then I'm going to be covering, well, most likely college game day. I probably won't, but I'll be live from like 12 to 1 a.m. It's going to be college football all day here on this channel. Four streams every weekend. Except when USF has a home game. So on four of the weekends, I will not. But otherwise, college football, if you need a home for college football coverage, this is the channel for you guys right here. Because I have a passion for college football. I love college football. And I this is why I wanted to do this game, because I wanted to get in the flow of things for college football, kind of grow up college football base. So I hope you guys will join me in those streams. I'll be live for BYU Navy on Monday, and then on Saturday the 12th, um, there's not too many games on that week. There's a few. I'll probably do two or three. And then it's really in October when I'll be getting into those four games uh, a weekend due to the fact that a lot of the SEC teams aren't playing until October. But you appreciate it. You will be the one. Well, I appreciate it. You'll appreciate everyone who is tuning on back in. Arkansas plays Georgia, Florida, LSU, Bama. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Five L's right there. Don't even got it. South Carolina has improved for sure. I'm happy I got the iPhone to level away. That's good for you, man. Odds to win the SEC title, Alabama is number one, and then they went away from the screen too, too uh, quick. We got 19 in the chat. I do appreciate everyone who is, uh, yeah, I do appreciate it, guys. Again, right, like, again, any games you want me to do, because I will probably be covering over 50 games this college football season, and I will be covering every bowl game that I can, every single bowl game. There will probably be a couple days when my team makes a bowl game, or hopefully makes a bowl game, that I won't be able to do. Um, because I will be traveling, and there are some games that I'll be, uh, you know, watching this. So, but if there's a game and you want me to do it, I will find a way to make it happen. So, if you need coverage for any sort of game, you guys just let me know, and I got you with the live streams. And I'm going to be doing some of these big-time games, so just watch out for them. Uh, 12 days until the NFL is here, also as well on the channel, we do NFL. We do NFL here on this channel as well, so just, again, more, uh, we do... Tons, tons of stuff, man. NBA update. Okay, okay, vintage. Vintage, I like it. Vintage, I like it, man. Hey, I keep that up, man. I know you'll come in after the stream uh, or after that game. Enjoy the Blazers. Get it done. Get it done, man. I believe in you. Alrighty, the FBS Week 1 schedule. This is on Saturday, Eastern Kentucky at Marshall at 1 p.m. SMU at Texas State at 4.30. Arkansas State at Memphis at 8 p.m. And then BYU at Navy. At 8 p.m. on Monday. I'll be live for that one. And then I'll be live for one of the other games. Not exactly sure which one of those games that I will be covering on Saturday. 
Do you know Notre Dame has moved to the ACC? Yes, I do know they moved to the ACC. Um, and, you know, they, they they actually just scheduled, Notre Dame just scheduled USF, and I don't know if you were early in the stream, but if Notre Dame does allow fans, I am going to be going to uh, South Bend on September 18th, or the game's on the 19th, but I'll go up on the 17th, on the 18th, and I'm going to go to the uh, Notre Dame game because I'm a big-time USF fan. Yeah, but Notre Dame, I, obviously this is a move that they've been looking to make. They've been looking to make, and I, and I believe they need to get into a conference, you know, because when we look at them, we we think that conference championship game is so vital, and I think the reason so many of the committee, of the playoff committee, looks Notre Dame out is because of the fact that they're not in a conference. They're not in a conference, and so that in itself hurts them right there. That, that That's just in itself hurts them. And, and that and that's why for me they just they just they they need to make con so I'm glad that they are in a conference now I I really really am live stream UTSA versus BYU and Texas versus Oklahoma obviously we stream in Texas versus Oklahoma no doubt about that not exactly sure um about the other one but I will try my best mystery. Arkansas was supposed to play Notre Dame before COVID. South Bend would have been awesome. And yeah, I've actually been to South Bend when my uh, when USF played them um, back in 2011 when I was six years old. We actually uh, pulled the upset, 23 to 20. You guys are just joining us here today, uh, or just joining us here now. The second half of basketball or basketball of football action is going to be getting underway here in just a little bit, guys. Just a little bit to this game, or or till we get back underway here with this one. Should be a great rest of this one here today, guys. Pretty sure everyone was stepping on in. Oh, look at that. Someone is illegally showing the game. That's nice. Of course they are. Man, oh, man. But second half, about to get underway here with basketball action. Got a pass. Jeez, man. We're about to get underway here with action here in just a little bit, guys. Just a little bit till this one does get underway here for the second half of basketball. Uh, Gee, if I keep saying basketball, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose my crap, man. But second half should be getting underway here in just a little bit, guys. Just a little bit till this one does get underway, man. Do appreciate everyone again who is stepping on into the stream, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying it, man. Man, oh man. Alrighty, but halftime should be getting underway. Central Arkansas will receive the second half kick uh, to start us off here. Central Arkansas will receive it, so. Um, obviously, big times. Uh, they need it. They they need that. They need to get something going. You know, to to, to start this off, man. They really, they really, really do because it is going to be and an, an vital to get to getting this win. They have got to get su stuff going up on the offensive side of the ball, man. And it's so important. Ten to six. We're about to get underway here with the second quarter. I swear, as Notre Dame plays Clemson, I hope they win. I don't know if they're playing Clemson. I don't know if they are. I do not know if they are. Can you do the Chiefs and Texans? Oh, I cannot do that one, man. I can. I, sadly, I'm not going to be able to do that one, man. I wish I could, but um, I will not. I, I, I will. I will not be covering that game. I, I'm sorry about that. Where can I watch the live stream? Someone help me, Yolo Bozo. I don't know where you can watch the live stream, man. But I will be doing the live play-by-play -play reaction the entire game, man. I'll be doing it the entire game, man. So hope you will. Tune on into the uh, or stay on into the stream, man. I do appreciate everyone who is stopping on in. All righty, man. Here we go. Let's freaking go, man. Second half should be getting away in a little bit. Halftime has been a little bit longer than I thought it would be, but we should be getting going in just a little bit, guys. Just a little bit. Hey, I appreciate you tuning in, man. I do appreciate you tuning on into the stream, man. Should be a fun second half of basketball action. That, oh, oh goodness, so good set, uh, good second half of college football action. I'm so glad that the the season is now officially underway here, man. It's it's awesome that that it's actually it's actually here, man. College football is back. Are you going to stream the uh, Patriots versus Dolphins season opener? Yes, I will. You know it, man. On Sunday, that is the game that I will be doing. So if you do want to tune in for that one, man, you feel free because I will be doing that one as well. I mean, again, tons of football content here coming in, guys. Yeah, you know, like absolutely a ton. 
man, I've got a spam report this guy. Alrighty, man. So, drop down your predictions for the second half of the basketball. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm going to learn eventually. Drop down your predictions for this second half of play, guys. Drop down your predictions. Let me know who you guys think is going to win this game. Let me know who you guys think is going to win this game down below in the comment section below, guys. Drop down who you guys think is going to win and leave a score prediction down below as well. If you guys did drop a score prediction before halftime um, did start in, I will look at it. And you guys will be able to see if you guys can, what do you call it, if you guys can win some money here today. Um, well, I'll, everyone's going to be streaming the Fortnite, uh, but your boy Roach just streams the 49ers game. So, I'm going to, I'm not, I'm not going to do that one again. So, I'm a Patriots fan. Well, Dolphins are out to get you, man. Dolphins are going to get you, bro. I'm telling you. I don't know why you guys are favored in that game. I really don't. It, it genuinely confuses me how you guys are favored, but we are back. Second half of bounce or second half of action here getting underway here in this one, guys. Should be a fun, fun second half. Some guy is illegally showing the stream. If you guys would go report it, guys, just look up this uh this stream live and then go report that stream. Cause that is not a that's just not cool, bro. Dang, bro. Welcome in Esteban. Welcome on into the stream, brother. I appreciate you stopping on in, man. What's going on? 24-20, he's got Central Arkansas taking the dub here today. Hey, we'll see, man. Should be a fantastic second half of basketball. I, I, oh, my God. I, I'm going to get better one day, I swear. I swear, one day. One day, I'm going to get better. But, all righty, man. I'm going to start Cam. I bet he goes all the way. I hey, wouldn't be surprised, man. Cam Newton such an underrated pickup, man. He really is such an underrated pickup. And we are underway with the third quarter kickoff. Just about underway here. It'll... Uh, let me see this real quick. Got to change the quarter. And boom. Third quarter underway. What's going on, JD Cards? Welcome into the stream. Do appreciate you stopping. How are you doing today, bro? Third quarter getting underway here. It will be Central Arkansas back to return. As Paul Lietzi is going to kick this one away. As with the third quarter of basketball action. About to get underway here in this one. Uh, the third quarter of football action. And the kick is up and away as we begin the third quarter of the first day of college football. And it's going to be fielded at the four-yard line. Looking for a return. He's got some open cross. Look at him go. Needs one more block. And look at him go to the 40. And gets all the way to the 44-yard line. A great start for Central Arkansas to start us off here in the third quarter. And, and, and that is exactly what they needed here today. They, oh, not what they needed there to start us off. They needed to get momentum. And that is a fantastic job to get some. I know. It, it, it's, uh, you have to understand. I have been calling. I've been calling the NBA. Or sorry, not the NBA. I've been calling the, the NBA so much. Like since December. That that's what my head's at right now. But I'll get used to it, especially since more college football is coming. Here we go. They've got the ball at the 44-yard line. It's first down and 10 in the shotgun. They're going to hand it off up the middle, looking for some room. Bounces off the tackle. Look at him go. He's got some room, and he's going to pick up 15 yards. And he gets the first down as Central Arkansas has moving the ball well here to start this second half of play. And you look at it, at first, nothing. He doesn't panic. He hits around the corner. He bounces right off of it and gets the first down. You see it travels uh, to Fargo. It, yeah, it'll see. And, uh, hey, man, here we go. They've got the ball at the 39-yard line of Austin P. Takes it out of the shotgun. They're going to hand it off again. Cuts on the left side, makes another cut, breaks the tackle, and he's going to pick up about five yards. It'll be second down and five. Hey, you've got to like what you're seeing here from the offense so far of Central Arkansas. But what they've got to focus on doing here is converting. Converting and making it into a touchdown. Here we go. They'll take it out of the shotgun again. They'll hand it off again. He's got room up the middle. Look at him go. Nobody's going to catch him. Touchdown. Central Arkansas with a minute. It only took him exactly one minute. They have taken the lead 12 to 10. It's Crossley with a 34-yard rushing touchdown up the middle. It's 12 to 10. 
And that is exactly what I'm talking about with Central Arkansas. Taking the ball, making it work, takes it right up the middle, and right there. It was a beautiful block by the offensive line. They took control on this third quarter, and now they're leading 12 to 10 as the Oxter point is up and underway, and it's up, and it is right down through the middle at 13-10. One minute through the third quarter, Central Arkansas said, we are coming to play. We got a good one on our hands, folks. 13 to 10 is your score. Holy crap, man. Just, just like that, a fantastic game. I, I mean, just just like that, man. I, I mean, that is, that is absolutely a fantastic job right there. And 13 to 10 now is the score here. Man, oh, man, we've got a game all of a sudden, ladies and gentlemen. And just like that, Central Arkansas on top and it was a it was a beautifully designed draw play and he just hit the hole right at the middle and i know my man bill is up on it right now a bill is excited man my phone's gonna die so i'll charge it i'll see you. all right sounds good man have a great rest of your day brother if you, if you happen to not uh, tune back on in 14 minutes to go here in the third quarter still got plenty of time come on man i I hate when people do that. I hate when people do that. It is the most annoying thing. But, man, big time rush right there as it is now 30. I mean, and sorry, not 30. It is now 13 to 10. Just like that. Here we go. And the kickoff is up, and it is underway, and it's going to be booted away in the back of the end zone right there. So it'll be first down and 10 for Austin Peavy here. 14 minutes ago here in this first, uh, sorry, in this third quarter. So it'll be first down and 10 at the 25-yard line. At the 25-yard line. Come on, man. Hold on one second, y'all. Just got to work on doing this real quick. Come on. How does that happen? All right. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. First down and 10 here. Appreciate everyone who is stepping on into the stream, guys. 14 minutes to go here in this one, and they'll take it out of the shotgun, looking to get something rolling. Here we go. Takes it under the shotgun. Get up. Drop back in the pocket under pressure. Throws it. Got a man open, and he brings it in down and holds it in for a first down right there. Nice reception. And it's now first down and 10 just like that. Hey, that was a that was a that was really a fantastic play right there. That was that was really a fantastic play. Here we go. First down and ten. Gonna you know, hand it off right now and looking to bounce and cannot. He's wrapped up, picked up, and then thrown to the ground. A fantastic play. And he's gonna maybe get one yard there on that play. Second down and nine would be my guess. Final F uh football score. Cornerstone Warriors twenty four. Is that uh high school football? And that's what I would that's what I would assume that would be. Alright, come on. Is it not getting taken down? Alright, here we go. Second down and nine here. Can I snake it on another gun? Hands it off. And nowhere to go again. And he's gonna lose the yard. Gonna lose the yard right there. And it's not a third down and ten. And and this is what and you know what? That, that it has been Central Arkansas coming out with a message here in this third quarter defensively as well. Now, what's up, little man? I don't like uh, what you're viewing, but I love uh, the energy. So I'm here. Well, I appreciate that, the Reaper. I know it's not the best game um, to you know to watch. So, but I do appreciate you, you know, tuning on into the stream, and I do appreciate it. All righty, here we go. All right, here we go. Third down and nine here. Big time play. So they didn't lose the yard. Third down and nine. Takes it on the shotgun. Look, she fires over the middle. It's incomplete. And that's now fourth down. Beautiful. Again. They, I mean, they just are just, wow. And the defense coming out with the message strong and clear. And that's going to force Austin P to punt this ball away. And the layout. Lakers are probably going to, Lakers are probably going to secure this one up, man. The Lakers are for sure probably get, nah, they're going to they're going to clear this one up. All righty, fourth down and nine here, big time play right here. And are they going to go for it? They are. They're going for it here on fourth and nine. 
Fourth down and nine. Your energy is unmatched. Can't wait to blag. Appreciate it, brother. Here we go. And never mind. They're going to punt this one away. And they kind of knew it was coming. And now they're back to the return. Making a jab step. And now he's just going to go out of bounds. And so it'll be first down and ten. When we probably come back from this commercial timeout would be my guess. But I'm not exactly sure. All right. Let's see. Yep. We are going to a commercial timeout, ladies and gentlemen, with 12.05 remaining in the third quarter. And Central Arkansas playing really well here in this third quarter, up 13 to 10. One sec, I'm going to make this. Bro, might get popped. All righty, man. 13 to 10. Is the score here in this one right now, man? Again, do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream. Oh, man. We have, we have got a great game going on our hands right now, man. Do appreciate everyone who is stopping on in. We have got a great game on our hands right now. Here we go. Why play? They're here to play. They are here to play, man. They are here to play. They're playing a fantastic game right now, guys. I mean, they're, they're not playing bad right now. I mean... They, and they need it. They they really do need this right now because Central Arkansas they struggle. They were down ten nothing, remember? But they they really they really turned it around here in this one. They have turned it around, man. And of course, now that it's a close game, some guy decided to show the game, and it's so annoying. And it's it, What the heck? All right, man. Whatever, whatever. All righty, man. 13 and 10, though, the score, though. Do appreciate everyone tuning on in. Little man, do you know I'm a patron? You know, I did not, man. But, oh, now nah, I know. Oh, you like a lot of Boston teams, so nah, I'm not I'm not too surprised. I'm not too surprised, man, but welcome on in. Patriots uh, will take the AFC East. Ah, I don't know. I don't I don't think so, man. I think the Bills take it and the Dolphins finish second, and then the Patriots finish in a close third. That that's what that that would be my guess to to, to what happens here. Um it'll it'll for sure be interesting though. Here we go. We're back on the way with first down and ten. They're gonna have a nice screen pass right there, and he's making some cuts. Good move, and it's a first down. It's just, just, just so, just so pure with it, man. Just, no, I mean they are just moving the ball down the floor, and they are uh, down the field, and they're making it look easy. First down and ten right now. Central Arkansas here, breathing the air. Takes another gun. They're gonna hand it off in the middle. Bounces to the left side. Trips up right there. And oh, it's getting a little chippy right there between a defensive lineman and an offensive lineman right there. Um, on two opposing teams, it'll be second down and most likely around 12. And second down and 11. Alrighty, man. Chunk play. Yeah, Dol Dolphins have one of the best quarterbacks. Hey, we do, man. He He's going to turn us around, I'm telling you. Second down and 11 here. 11.30 to go here in the third quarter. Working with it here at the... Uh, at the oh, sorry. About, they're in the shotgun formation right here. Second down and 11. They put the ball at the 39-yard line. They're looking for the option. They pitch it. And there he goes. It's the corner. Makes a cut. And he's got the first down right there. Beautiful. It's just, it's just working so well offensively right now for Central Arkansas. They once again pick up the first down. And they, they just they got to keep it up, man. They're playing so well. All right, here we go. And I hand it off again. No, it's a play fit. Got him in over the middle. He drops it. It was a little bit of a bad throw, though. I'll give him that. He had to dive and try and make that one, but could not make that catch. Man, just tough luck right there. Second down and 10 now. Here we go. Do appreciate everyone who is stopping on in the stream. We got 13 people in the chat. Second down and 10. Here, oh wait, let me update that. My bad, my bad. All right, gonna hand it off here up the middle, and he's tripped up for a loss right there. Beautiful. Oh goodness gracious! Why isn't it turning down? 
Second down, and, and now, now it's going to be third down and around 11 yards right there. Beautiful play on the defensive side of the ball right there. Let's see what they – third down and 12. Third down and 12. 10 third and to go here in the third quarter. You're going to take it out of the shotgun here. They're, they got it at the 49-yard line and looks over to the sideline to make the play. Here we go. Takes it under the gun. Now drops back. Looking under pressure, throws it to the side. He's going to be tackled only for a gain of four. And it's fourth down and eight. A good hold right there. A great hold right there by the defense. Fourth down and eight now, the score. Or not, no, fourth down and eight now, as it'll be the punt team coming on now for Central Arkansas. Central Arkansas will bring it down. Hey, come on, bro. What the hell is this? Unbelievable. All righty, man. Mike Norval playing for UCA and rock some amazing drive back. Yes, Mike Norval. He's the coach of oh, he's the coach of Florida State now. As the punt team comes on, they boot it away. And a fair catch is made. Oh, and he doesn't end up catching it. Oh, my God. They missed the downing. He slipped, and they could have downed him at the 1. And instead, it'll be first down and 10 at the 20. Oh, my God. How did he miss him, dude? Wow, dude. All righty, man. Do again. Appreciate everyone who is stepping on in the stream, man. Sucks that someone is illegally showing the stream, so that's probably why there are less people in here now because he is taking the viewers. From. It's all right, man. I'm not too worried about it, man. I'm just going to finish up calling this game, man. I, I, I like how everyone under me. I, I, I'm not. I just, I don't know, man. I just don't know if you guys are going to be able to keep up, man. I don't. But, hey, I wouldn't be surprised, but I, w I wouldn't be surprised, but. Got injured? Who got injured? Who got injured? Did I don't? I mean, I don't know who got injured, but thirteen to ten the score. Do appreciate everyone tuning on into the stream. Six people in the chat. Do appreciate you guys who are still tuning on into the stream, guys. It does mean a lot. You know what? It is. It is okay. And we only got six people in here because hey, if all six of you are subscribed and I see we got some new people in here, that's what matters, man. That's what matters. So, do appreciate all the support. If you guys have not done so already, smash the like and hit that subscribe button for more college football content like this. I don't think we're going to hit our goal today, man, but hey, we're two away. Come on, man. We are two away, guys, and we can hit this goal. We can hit this goal today, guys. I believe in us. Let's get it done. All righty, man. Who we are again on a commercial timeout right now, guys. Commercial timeout. Obviously, FCS game. Getting just getting us started here with college football. Obviously, two teams that are not too popular, so I understand. But welcome in, Heidi. What's going on, Heidi? It's okay, little man. I know you're a Dolphins fan. No judgment here. I'm just excited. I think the Dolphins have a legitimate shot this season to make the playoff or the wild card. 9:23 remaining here in the third quarter. Austin P, uh, P with the ball now here as they look to. Regain the lead they once had. They were up 10 0, but they've given up 13 straight points here in this one. All righty, here we go. Under the gun. Now looks back in the pocket. Fires deep down the field. He's got them all, but he overthrew him. He overthrew me. Had a man. If he would have put it right on target, he would have been in the back of the end zone right there. And it's now second down and 10. Oh, it's just a tough luck right there. It was a beautiful design play. Had him beat. Had him beat by a lot, too. And just could not make the play. Second down and 10 now. Second down and 10. He's taking it out. On, he's taking it out in the shotgun. Looks back. Looking to his right. Throws it over to the corner. And it's going to be deflected. Otherwise, he had a man wide open on the corner. Just could not get it to him. And it's now third down and 10. 9-12 here remaining in the third quarter. We've still got a ton of more time here remaining in this one. Taking the train, I need to stop. What do you mean taking the train, bro? 
Third down and 10. 9-12 to go here in the third quarter. Big time. Big, big, big time. Play right here. Ever it's happening, it needs to stop. All right, here we go. Out of the shotgun. Third down and 10. Looks back in the pocket. He's going to throw it right over the corner. Now looking to hit the corner and make some yards. Diving. He's going to fall short. It is fourth down and three. Falls short of the first down right there. They threw it out. Kind of just did a... They kind of just did like a screen play almost. Um, but it was kind of just a rollout screen. And then he tried to push over to that right side and push for the first down. But could not reach it. Fourth down and three. As it is now, big. I mean, um, they're gonna have to punt the ball away unless they go for it. But they're deep back in the zone, so I'm not. I don't. I don't think that they are gonna go for it here. I, I would. I would. I would be surprised um, if they did. If they did go for it. Alrighty, man. Again, do appreciate everyone who is stepping on into the stream. All right, thirteen to ten is the score. It will be. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Whose ball will it be? Uh, we're most likely to see a punt here. We're most likely to see a punt here from Austin, uh, P. And so Central Arkansas will take control of the ball here. And, and you know what? Ar Central Arkansas cannot put this game away, but they can. They, can, I mean, they really can at the same time because because when you when you think about it, bro. That, I, I mean, they're just gonna be able to just ah. I think I think I do think they're gonna pull pull away with it. There was there was just an injury play. Yeah, oh, that's right. Yep. Yeah, I did see him. So that's why we did go to the commercial timeout before the fourth down and three right there, guys. That is why. So we are still waiting on that. Um, well, we are still waiting on him, on the game to come back now due to the fact that there was an injury. It'll be fourth down and three when we do come back again. If you have not done so already, smash the like, hit that subscribe button, and turn on that notification bell, guys. So you never miss when we do go live for college football or the NBA or any sport here on the channel, guys. Really do appreciate all the support, guys. We are two subscribers away from our goal of the day, guys. So we'll be back here with some more basketball. Goodness. We'll be back here some, with some more action here in just a little bit, guys. Just a little bit till this game does get back underway, guys. Just a little bit. So... Seeing what the cause is, or or what he did, he's going back to. Well, he's going in the tent right now to kind of see what happened, right? Or to look at him. That was DeAndre Lamont, uh, a junior, 5'11", 182 pounds, out of Baytown, Texas. All right, here we go. So we are. It's fourth and three, and they're going for it. Never mind. They'll they'll just punt it away. They always like to fake that they're going for it. And oh, they pushed him in. I don't know if that was illegal. Legal. They pushed the runner into the ball. Like, he, and the ball was going, it got past the punt returner. So, then he was going back to get it, and then they pushed him into it. He ended up catching it, but still, I don't know if that was allowed, but it'll now be first down and 10. We've got 8.48 here remaining in this one. 8.48 remaining in this one. Really, again, do appreciate all the support here on, on the stream, guys. Make sure if you have not, again, done so already, smash the like. On Labor Day, just so you guys know, I will be back for BYU and Navy. That'll be on Monday at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. I will be live for that one. So, you guys want to tune in for that stream as well because I will be going live for that one. Here we go. Another shotgun now pitches it. Now he's got some open space. Look at him hit that left side and then tripped up right there after a gain of about eight yards. So, still a decent carry right there. And it'll be second down and eight or second down and two. I'm sorry. Second down and two coming up here. They're going fast. They're going no huddle. And the shotgun, they hike it right away. Here they'll hand it off again. No, the fake handoff. Now they got the tight end on the roll end. And look at him go. Lowers his shoulder. Stiff lowers him. Stays up and gets all the way to the 50-yard line. Hits a first down. Beautiful play right there. That, that is just, I mean, I mean, you just look at that. That is just a fantastic play right there. And just lowers his shoulder, breaks the tackle, gets a few extra yards. And it's stuff like that that's going to help you win this game. First down and 10 here. 805, eight, well, 806 here remaining in this one. So, we got, you know, still got time here in this. So there's still plenty of time remaining here in this one. If you guys have not done so already, let me know in the comments who you guys are cheering for. And an uh, injured player, it's Edwards III for Austin P. Let's see what happens. He just got absolutely trucked by the, the tight end. And so that's why he is down right now. Alrighty, man. 
Let me read up on that. What app do you use to keep the logos and score? Um, it's not. I I use an application called OBS Studios. I use OBS Studios to run my streams and all that good stuff. All righty, first down and ten here. They got it at the 49 yard line. Here we go, looking back in the pocket. They'll throw it to the sideline. Did he get his feet in bounds? He did. Nice play right there and a nice catch on the sideline right there. It'll be second down and one. And look, I mean, and that's an NFL catch. He got both feet down. He wanted to make sure that he came down with that reception. First down and 10 here under the shotgun. And that's going to be, I believe, a false start, which is going to push him back five yards. And it, or maybe not. Maybe they're going to review the play. I think that's what it is. Because, yeah, they are going to review the play, even though that was clear as day. That he made the reception inbounds. The ruling on the field was pass complete. Let's look at this again just to make sure. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. He got two feet down. My God. He got two feet down. That is absolutely. Yeah. That, that they should. Uh, yeah. I don't. I, it, no way. And there's no way you're going to win. It would be wrong to overturn it, too. And that would just be the wrong call. I mean, I mean that's that's as simple as that right there. I mean, it is as simple as that. Welcome in, Ashley. Welcome into the stream. How are you doing today, Ashley? And that was a quick review as it's going to be. Uh, the ruling on the field is confirmed. It will be a catch. It'll be second down and one here for Central Arkansas. 7.43 here to go in the third quarter here. Do appreciate it again, everyone. Stop it on into the stream, man. Now, I know it's not the ideal matchup for you guys, but trust me, better matchups will be on the way soon. All righty. But still, it's been an entertaining game so far. Here we go. Central Arkansas out of the shotgun. Second down and one. They're going to fake the handoff. Now, got on the screen. I'm looking him go. Breaks free on the sideline, and he gets around eight yards on that play. And it's going to be a first down for Central Arkansas as they are just driving down the field. Or, yeah, driving down the field once again here. They had oh, their one possession here in the third quarter. They drove right down the field. They've already got 120 yards here in the third quarter compared to Austin Peace, 19. Here we go. First down and 10 out of the shotgun. Looking as he's going to reset the play. He's going to switch up the play with the offensive lineman. Here we go. First down and 10. Here comes the option. They're going to pitch it. It's fumbled. They lose it. And it's going to be picked up by Austin P. Both teams now have lost it. And look at that. Austin P. has now taken control of the ball. A terrible play. It was a, I don't know why he pitched it. I don't know why he pitched it. That was a terrible. And then he dropped the pitch. Let's look at this again. I just a, a, They knew it was coming, and he just dropped it. And they could not get it. And it was picked up by Austin P. And now the momentum has switched just like that. And, and that and that and that'll cost you. They, uh, Central Arkansas had all the momentum. All of it. They had every single bit of momentum. And they just blew that momentum. 6.52 to go in the third. And as I said, we've got an entertaining game going. All right, here we go. Looking back in the pocket. Looking, looking. And he's going to be wrapped up and set behind the line. Great play right there. And it'll be second down. And around 13, maybe, or 12. Great defensive stand right though. And, and Central Arkansas has really put the pressure on Austin, Austin P here in this second half. And they have been getting some good pressure on the line as well. They've been blitzing really nice. Really nice here, especially in the second half. Second down and 12. 6-18 to go here in the third quarter. In the shotgun formation, second down and 12. Drops back in the pocket now. He's going to hand it off up the middle. Looking for some space. Cannot find. Well, he finds some. He gets around three yards. It'll be third down and nine. Third down and nine underway here. Big time play here. You, you just got the turnover. If you are Austin P, you have got to find a way to get some momentum going on your side. And, and, and that involves you getting a first down here. Third down and nine here. A big time play. For Austin Peay. Here we go. 
Third down and nine. They're in the shotgun formation. He's going to drop back. Looking. Throws it deep down the field. It is incomplete. And no flag is called. Way to turn at the – well, I want to look at this again because I'm not 100% sure if he turned his body. Let's see. No, he did. He turned. I, I mean, I, that's legal. Good play right there, and that's going to cost fourth down to nine. And I, they might be going for this, though. They might be going for this. The offense is wrong, but they just keep – yeah, they do, man. They absolutely just keep shooting themselves in the foot, and yeah, it's stuff like that you just cannot have in a game like this. All righty, 49, and they are going for it. A big-time play. You're on our way. And the shotgun. They look back. They're dropping the – but no, they're going to punt it. I really thought they were going to go for it. And now it's going to be down, down around the 8. Yo, oh, the 5, the 4, the 3. Down at the 3-yard line. Takes it, Austin P. Roll. And just like that, 5-13 to go here in the third quarter. Central Arkansas will take over here at the 3-yard line. Of their own. They, again, got, they got to really get something going here, man. You got 12 people in the chat. I do appreciate everyone tuning in. Uh, his name is Devine Garcia. They called up. Oh, that's right. Hey, that's good, man. They need it because the Yankees have been so. Oh, wow. It was just an eight-point deficit. All right, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, bro. I respect it. Keep it up, bro. Keep it up. Hey, who knows, man? Maybe you guys are going to be able to pull this one out. All righty, here we go. 13 to 10 here is the score here. They're back in their own end zone. They're going to hand it off, looking for some room. They don't find too much. They only find about one yard on that play. It'll be second down and nine. Yeah, I mean, but again, you're in the back of the end zone. You just got to try and find something, you know, to get out, you know, of that area. So I, I, like, the, I like the play. You gain two yards. Now you look the pass here. Second down and eight here. Again, out of the shotgun formation. Got two wide receivers outside. Now fake, now fake the throw it. Now fake the handoff, and he's wide open on the corner. And look at him explode off the corner right there. A beautiful fake, a beautiful play action right there. He's then wide open on the first down marker on the left corner. And then just look at him explode down the sideline. Just totally jokes him out, stays in bounds, and gets a couple of extra yards. And it's now first down and 10. First down and 10, 420 to go here in the third quarter. If you know, you know. Under the gun, he's with it. Takes it. A play action. Looking. Gonna throw it, got a man, and it's going to overthrow his receiver right there. It'll go down to second and ten. Just could not find him right there. And, and that, and then it's just a matter of like being able to hit. But it was good defense, though. At the same time, it was double team, so it was some solid defense out of him. But still, gotta gotta work on hitting those throws right there. Thirteen to thirteen, the score. Four eleven here remaining. In the third quarter of action, we've got an exciting game going on here today, man. Here we go. Taking it up under the shotgun. Gonna now another play action. Now with a pressure scrambling on the right side. Throws it deep down the field. No, he missed him. He knew he had him. Like he had him, but he drops it. Oh my it's it's stuff like the, the offense. That they, they have it there. It's there, but let's look at this again. It's a tough throw. So that it's not like a spiral, but he, just, he misjudges the ball. It's now third down and ten. Oh, if he caught that, he's probably in the back of the end zone. Oh, that is just such tough luck for Central Arkansas right there. Third down and ten, though, now. Here we go. Four or three remaining here in the third quarter. Third down and ten. Smith in the shotgun now. Switches up the play at the offensive line. Sees something that the defense doesn't. Here we go. Takes it. Steps back in the pocket. Now he's scrambling. Needs some blockers. Uses the blockers. Trying to go forward. Can he get there? Oh, holy crap, voice crack. Dang. Boy, you need to hit some puberty, son. But fourth down and one. He is a yard short right there. Fourth down and one. And I have hit puberty. Just my voice needs to get lower, man. Holy cow, dog. Fourth down and one. Just he, he, I don't know why he he stutter stepped right there and just waited. So I don't I don't know about the, I don't I don't I don't know about how how I I I don't like how he approached that play. This is what I meant. Just execute. Yeah, 
They, and they, they need to execute, and they and that's where they have been struggling. They have been absolutely struggling executing the ball here as the punt team now comes on and Ah, oh, dang it. I forgot to move the thing, and here's the punt. Oh, a nice spin out of it, and now looking for some more yards, and he's going to be tackled down at the 30-yard line. It'll be first down and 10 when we do get back from this commercial timeout with 3.23 remaining in this one. First down and 10. When we do get back, or no, we're not going to commercial timeout here. What yard line? They uh, Austin P has the ball at the 30-yard line. They've got the ball at the 30-yard line right now. Alrighty, man. Make sure again, if you guys have not done so already, guys, smash up the like, hit that subscribe. How many are away? Or are we away from our goal? We are one subscriber away from our goal, guys, which is at, at, which is incredible, guys. Really do appreciate it, guys. Smash the like, hit that subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel, guys. Thirteen to ten. Under the shotgun, three twenty-three remaining. Here's that pitch. It worked for him once. Evans. Cuts, but he's tripped up this time. A good play right there. And he's going to find his way for about two, three yards on that play. Evan C. almost has a 100-yard rushing, 100 yards rushing so far on the day. Second down and eight as he picks up two yards on that play. So nothing spectacular, but under three minutes to go here. As the offensive line or the offensive sideline gives them the call for this one. Second down and eight out of the shotgun formation. Really need to get something going. Oh, that's a false start. No, they're going to pitch it. And now they're going to bring it back down the left side. And they've got some blockers. And it's going to be a first down. Way to hit it. They threw it. They did a pitch to the right side. And then he just brought it all the way, all the way back around. I'll, I'll kind of motion it with my hands here so you guys can understand the play a little bit better. So they pitch it. To the right side, just do a little pitch, and then he just takes it and runs all the way to the left side where he's got blockers on that left side, and he picks up the first down. Got 11 in the chat. Do appreciate everyone who is tuning on into the stream. 2.20 to go here in the third quarter in the shotgun formation. Looking to the sideline now for the play. You got 2.15 remaining here in the third quarter. 13-10 in the opening game of college football 2020 season. Scrambling. Find someone on the right side. And hit for a loss. A great play right there by the defense. Number 15. I would say his last name, but I don't. their names are not on the back of their jerseys for Central Arkansas. They actually pick up one yard on that play. It'll be second down and nine. Second down and nine here. 150 to go here in the third quarter. Central Arkansas was down 10 nothing in this game, but they are now up in this one three. I'm at 13 nothing. The Los Angeles Lakers are winning. Hey, it's a close game over there, Wyatt. It is, man. I'm surprised because Damian Lillard is not playing. Welcome in, Nathan. How are you doing today, bro? Here we go. Another fake handoff right there. Now the quarterback will just take it himself, and he's gonna get around three yards on that carry, and it'll now be third down and six. Third down and six here, and again th this. Central Arkansas defense has been playing so well on this defense side of the I mean, they are just, man, they are just bringing it to them right now, man. They really are. My cousin Abby Lee thanks your cue. Uh, I don't, I don't know how, I don't know if you're cabin or not, but I, I guess thank you, bro. I guess thank you. Third down and six under a minute to go here in the third quarter of action here. Third down and six under the shot clock. Under the shot clock. Under the sh uh, gee, yeah, I'm not even gonna say it. Third down and six under the shotgun. Five seconds to go before they got to snap the ball. And they will finally drop back pressure. Going to throw it. A nice start right there. And he picks up the first down. The man just starts that one right in there. And a big time first down. And that might just end the third quarter depending on if that. Let's see if they're going to run the clock or not. They might play do one more. That was a beautiful play. Did a little boom, boom. Hit him with the beautiful cut right there. First down and 10. Now throws it deep down the field, and that's going to be incomplete. So now it is second down and 10. Just overshot him right there. Just could not make that play. It was just, it was just a two rush right there. They tried to rush the play, which I didn't really agree with right there. So tonight for the wide receiver, or the top wide receiver, he's got two rece receptions and 39 yards so far. 21 seconds to go here in the third quarter. Central. Arkansas up 13 to 10. Big time play. They've got it at Central Arkansas's 37 yard line, so they're knocking in the range. 
Second and ten, another shotgun looking. Now another QB scramble. Nice cutting, but again, this Central Arkansas defense just swarms all over him. And that's going to be third down and nine would be my guess here. Third down and nine. Yes, third down and nine. And that is going to take us to the fourth quarter. We are one quarter away from the first game of the college football season being a wrap. The Central Arkansas Bears up right now in this one, 13 to 10. They run a 13-0 scoring run. Who will come out on top in this one? It should be a fun one to the finish line. Shout out Pace Vikings for a great football season. Well, welcome in Pace Vikings. Welcome in to the stream, man. I appreciate you stopping on in. Welcome in, Holmes. Maybe, man. Maybe, man. It's my first. Well, not my first college football game I've covered. I, it's been a while since I've covered college football. Obviously, uh, it was like the, in October. But, man, we have 14 people in the chat before this uh, fourth quarter does get underway, guys. Make sure to smash that like button, guys. Smash the like button. And if you guys are new to the channel as well, guys, hit that subscribe button as well, guys. It really, really does help out with the channel, guys. We are one subscriber away from our goal, guys. We are one subscriber away. Can we reach that goal, guys? I would really appreciate it, man. Should be a great rest of this game that we do have here, man. So, do appreciate everyone who is stopping on in. Shut up, peace, thank you. Yeah. Hey, man, I'm hoping we have a great football season, though, man. I'm so excited. I'm going to be doing this type of content all football season long. So that is something you are into. Smash the subscribe button. We're going to be doing, on most Saturdays, four college football streams a day on Saturdays. So if that is something you guys do want to tune into, smash the like and hit that subscribe button. Alrighty, man, but the fourth quarter about to get underway. Let me know in the comment section below. If you guys, I'm not done so already. Let me know who you guys think is going to win this game down in the comment section below. Do you guys got Austin Austin Pay coming back in the fourth quarter winning this one? They were up 10-0. Now they're down 13 to 10. Or do you got Central Arkansas winning this one here today in the fourth quarter? It's third down and nine when we come back. Well, as you guys can see, if you guys just tuning in, whoever, whenever you see this little uh, picture right there of the football. Whoever saw, oh, whoops, hold on. Who's ever side the football is, oh my gosh. Who's ever side the football is by is who has the ball. Just so you guys know who are just tuning on in to the stream, man. Do appreciate everyone tuning in. Welcome in, Brunson. Welcome in, Martiza. It's fast. Welcome in the stream. Well, I appreciate you tuning in. I, I guess thank you for the compliment as well. Um, and welcome in, uh, Peter Little Man, a little overrated. Well, Peter, that you, uh, you don't have to tune into the stream, man. You don't have to tune into the stream, brother. But okay. Um, all right. But the fourth quarter in, of action is going to get underway here in just a little bit, guys. Let me know again in the comment section. Who do you guys have pulling this game out? You got Central Arkansas or do you got Austin Pay or Austin P coming out with this one? Let me know who you guys think is going to win. Alrighty, man. And just so you guys know, there are fans in attendance here for this game. I mean, there are, there are fans in attendance, so that is obviously a great sign. I'm so excited to final win. When they do, when they do open up fans for my home team, which sounds like October 10th, I can't wait to go to college football game, man. I'm so excited, man. OT, uh, bro, OT would make this game great. I, yeah, I'm hoping OT, man. I would love that. I would love OT to start off the college football season. Welcome in, Jameen. Welcome into the stream. Appreciate everyone stopping in. Make sure to smash that like and subscribe if you have not done so already. Hit store down in nine. Here we go, Austin P. Drops back in the shotgun. He's scrambling. He's going to be tripped up, and he's going to be dropped after he only gains a yard. It's fourth down and eight. Now the question is, will they go for it? Will they punt it, or will they kick a field goal here? It, I got it. I, they, I mean, I guess they could kick a field goal, but I think they're going to go for this. I, I do. Welcome in the friend, Bray. Welcome in. Oh, and they're going to go for it on fourth down and eight. They're going for it, ladies and gentlemen. Fourth down and eight. The biggest play of this game so far in this one. Here we go. Going to switch. Wide receivers in motion. So it would be a 52-yard field goal from here. They are not taking it, though. Here we go. And no, I, think, I don't think they're going to do it. Nope. They're just going to take the penalty. Yep. They're taking the penalty. Great job by Central Arkansas. Not to bait. And it's going to be an... Or did, or did they call it timeout? Are they going to take the penalty? Or was it timeout called? Because that is big. Nope. They are going to take the flag. 
And now they're going to have to punt the ball away. A great stand right there. It'll be fourth down and 13. And now the punting team for Austin Peavy will come on. My first game last year of the 2019-20 season ended with double overtime. And it was great. Yeah. Um, you know what? Overtime's ga overtime games are never bad, man. They never are. I'm happy my team is finally winning. The question is, can we pull it out? Uh, is that what I assume you were going to say? It it's going to be tough. It's not going to be. I mean, it's going to be tough. But you guys, you guys can do it. Fourth down and 13. And they're just going to punt this one away. And let's see how good of a punt this one will be. And they're going to down him at around the seven-yard line. So a not-so-bad punt right there. It'll be first down and 10 for Central Arkansas. First down and 10 at their own seven-yard line. So big time plays here. Welcome in, Aaron. Welcome in, Aaron. Welcome on into the stream, dude. I do I do appreciate everyone who is stopping in. Little man, your stream is a nightmare. Uh, but, uh, what? Now, your stream is a nightmare, but awesome. Good job. I, I'm, is that because your name is Nightmare? I'm confused. 13-35 remaining here in the fourth quarter. Do again. Appreciate everyone who is stepping on in, man. Again, smash that like. Hit that subscribe button, guys. We are one subscriber away from our goal of the day. First down and 10. Takes it on our Smith. Going to hand it off up the middle. He's got some space. Look at him go. The 20, the 30, the 40. And look at him go as he now steps it around and around the 43-yard line. Beautiful run. That's going to be a gain of 26 right there. Just found the hole. Cuts to the left side. And then hits it. Their luckiest safety was back there to come and make that tackle. Otherwise, he would have gone the distance. First down and 10 now. Going to hear it hand it off again. Now it's a pitch. Oh, a flea flicker down the field. Oh, he was wide open, but he missed him. Oh, man. They tried the flea flicker on him. But would not work right there. It'll be second down and 10. And you know what? I like that, though. You just had a big play, and now go for the flea fl flicker. I absolutely love that play call right there. And now, but I mean, obviously, it didn't work. But second down and 10. If we execute, we win. Don't, yeah, just don't beat yourself. For real, man. You, if you guys can execute this game, you will win the game. You, it's for, for real. 13, 13 07 remaining here in the fourth quarter. Do appreciate everyone stopping in. Here we go. Smith resetting the play here with the offensive line. He's in the shotgun formation. He's got the running back over on his left side. Now drops back in the pocket. Looking. Looking. Swires over to the right side. And oh, what a catch. Did he have his feet in bounds? He did. And it's first down and 10 past midfield now. Beautiful pass. And, and, and that's where nobody but his receiver can catch him. What, it wasn't only a great throw, but it was a great pass right there. Beautiful play. First down and 10 here. 13 minutes to go. Where can I watch the game live? Alexander, due to copyright uh, regulations, I can't. I can only give the live play-by-play -play reaction to the game, man. So I hope you can tune in for that, or hope you will stand for that. First down and 10. 13 minutes to go in the fourth quarter. They got the ball at the Austin Pev or the Austin P 38-yard line. And this is just such a big play. And are they going to call a timeout? Is Central Arkansas really about to call a timeout? No, they're reviewing the play. The official play is under review to see if his feet were in bounds. Uh, I don't have any TV provided. Yeah, this game is on ESPN. If you do want to watch this game, if you do have access to that, of course, watch the game live on ESPN. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm all, I'm all, I'm all for that, man. I, absolutely with that. Yes, FCS isn't the greatest thing to stream. Doesn't, hey, man, but hey. Look, the crowds don't matter to me. I'm having a, you know what? You know, it's, it, you know what? Maybe I don't have more than 20 people in here, but we got 14 people in the chat, which is great. I gained four subscribers today, which in turn is like, oh, that's not great. But hey, don't worry about the views. The views don't mean anything. If you just put in the work, the views will come. And you know what? We got 14 people in here, and I'm grateful for the 14 people that are in here. And I appreciate it, man. And if you guys want to see more of this content, I'm going to be doing these live streams all throughout the college football season, guys. All throughout the college football season. I'll be back most likely on Monday, um, on Labor Day, for BYU and Navy. So I hope you guys will tune in uh, to those streams. I also do NBA uh, playoff live streams. I'll be doing MLB, college basketball, all this good stuff. Turn the cameras to the game. No one wants to see your face talking. Well, Alexander, I cannot do it due to copyright regulations, man. I cannot do that. Um, so I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to do that, man. I, this is what I do. I do play-by-play -play reactions here on my channel. If you do not want to stick around and watch for that, you can uh, obviously feel free to leave, and you can have a great rest of your day, bro.
What's going on, IO Chan tonight? Welcome on. Yeah, on ESPN, but I'd rather watch you. I actually appreciate that, man. Alex Hatch illegally showing the game, which will result. You're right. One, it would result in a strike, and I, I, who knows, bro? Who knows how far YouTube would take that, man? So I'm gonna. If, you, if you're not gonna respect the rules of YouTube, and you're just not gonna, res, uh, you know, get what you have here, man, then then just then just leave, man. I you know I don't want any negativity here, man. There's only positive vibes here. It's the first day of college football, all right? Nobody wants to see your negativity in the chat. That's what nobody wants to see. We're here to enjoy college football being back. And to call play-by-play -play for the re reaction. This is what I do on my channel, so lead me to it. Thank you. You you have a great rest of your day if you don't decide to watch this game. All right, here we go. First down and 10. Smith under the shotgun. The running back was right behind him. He now looks back in the pocket. Looking to the left side. Throws it deep to the end zone. Tough. Great defense right there. By Austin Pep in the corner on the safeties right there. It was a great effort right there to go down the field. Went for the long shot for the end zone. It was incomplete. It'll be second down and 10. Yeah, I'd rather listen to your commentary uh, the, the month the game on. Hey, I appreciate that, man. I really, I, I really do appreciate all the support, guys. Second down and 10. We got 16 in the chat, man. Make sure, again, if you have not done so already, smash the like and subscribe. We are one subscriber away, guys. One subscriber away from reaching my goal. All right, here we go. Second down and 10 at the 38-yard line. Wide receiver in motion. He's open on the right side. Now he's got a scramble. Oh, good moves by the quarterback. He lost the ball. Who came under it? They will recover the football. He lost that ball so close. To Austin P, uh, to Austin P, coming with the momentum here in this one. It's now second down and ten. Holy, that would have been such a momentum shift. Oh my goodness, man! You gotta go, White Boy. Hey, White, you have a great rest of your day. I hope to see you in a future stream, brother. Really do appreciate your support, and uh, you have a great rest of your day. Third down and eleven now. Crap, I forgot to update that. Third down 11. Now, backing down to the pocket. Scrambling away. He's going to run for it. Can he get there? And he's not going to be able to. He gets to around the 33-yard line. Is that enough for field goal range, though? Is that enough for field goal range is the question. And, and it's a big question. It's fourth down and five. They might just go for it here. I don't think these field goal kickers are all too good. Because I believe... I. I I think they're going to, yeah, here we go. I think they're going for it. I think they're staying on the field here. Fourth down and five. Such a big play underway here in this one. This is my favorite background noise uh, while I game, so he's really good. I do appreciate that, man. Fourth down and five. Tonight, they're one of three. Last season, they were six of 16, 38% from uh, on third down to on fourth down conversions. Big play right here. And nope, never mind. They're just going to let the, the time run, so they're not going to go for it on fourth down. They'll take the delay game penalty. It'll be fourth down and 10, and the punt team will have to come out here. And if you guys, when 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 the thing switches, can you guys remind me to switch this football? Because I always forget. I always forget to, to remind it, man. Is Tyrone Harper playing? I'm not exactly sure, uh, Antoine. No, if he plays on Central Arkansas, none of the names are on the back. So tell me what position he plays, and I'll try and get, I'll try and do my best. So does Central. Yeah. All right, here we go. So the punt team out now for Central Arkansas. Fronting from about their own 50-yard line. And a good snap. Punts it away. And can they down them? Here we go. It bounce. Oh, no, it's going to be fair. Caught it around the 11-yard line. And it will now be Austin P. Or Austin P. P. Ball. Austin P. Yeah, I'm saying that right. Austin P's ball. First down and 10. Wait, there is a flag. So hold on. I'm not exactly sure. What the call is here, uh, definitely an interesting call here. Maybe it was an offside or false start or something. But again, not exactly sure. I will find out for you guys in just a second what this call is. The referees are discussing. Well, yeah, I mean, it was 4th and 10. They had it around their 40-yard line, so they didn't want to risk it. And they should have went for it on 4th and 5, if you want me to be honest. But they did not. I'm still waiting on exactly what this call is. Oh, unsportsmanlike conduct on Austin P. I think. I think. Oh, and then it was on. Whoa. Excuse me, guys. Sorry, I did not mean. I dropped my phone. It was unsportsmanlike conduct on both players. So both players will pick up the foul, and I appreciate that, Dakota man. Tyrone is the starting running back for Arkansas, but he opted out this season. 
Uh, well then, I obviously, no, he is not playing. Thank you for letting me know. And we got 11.05 to go here, and we are headed to a commercial timeout, everybody. We're going to a commercial timeout. We got 17 in the chat, man. You got school Monday. I got school Monday, man. That's crazy that I start schooling uh, literally in one day, man. But really, again, to appreciate all the support, guys. Guys, if you have not done so already, smash that like, hit that subscribe button, guys. I'm going to be doing this all college football season long, and I thank you guys so much, man. This has been a fantastic stream. Five subscribers gained, and I know that doesn't seem like a lot, but for this type of game, five subscribers, I am thrilled with that, guys. I, I really am, and I appreciate all the support, and don't worry, man. Tons of more college football streams coming up. Probably the next one will be on Saturday, and then I haven't decided what game on Saturday. And then on on Monday, BYU and Navy on uh, Labor Day. So hope to see you guys in there for that one again. Anybody just joining us in here, we are on a commercial timeout. But I thought uh, Pay had the ball. They, they do. They do have the ball right now. I'm sorry. I, I'm I'm gonna working on. It. I'm working on getting that the football. But right now, uh, Austin, um, Austin, the governors have the ball right now. Um, at around the 11 yard line. They have it around the their own 11 yard line. Nuggets are gonna be. Come on, Jaquan. Don't be like that. Mystery, didn't you see a starting tackle just transfer to Baylor? I'm I'm not sure, man. That would be you. But really do appreciate it again. Everyone stopping it, man. We got a close game brewing on our hands right now, man. We we've, we've got a close one. Welcome in, Manny. Frankie Gar uh, Garcia's uh, wide receiver for Arkansas out for injury. I haven't seen him. I have not seen him uh, on the floor or on the field yet. Or uh, uh, That's at least me. But a lot of these players don't have names on the back of their jersey. And um, I'll, try, I'll try my best and get you the names, but I have not seen him just yet, uh, Manny. Alrighty, man. Just and you know what's great is that there's a crowd in this game. There's there's a crowd in the stands. Social distance, obviously, but I, that that just excites me. When football is back. We're we're somewhat getting back to a normal life now. 11:05 to go in the fourth quarter. Austin, uh, P, P starting the ball here with the ball at the 11 yard line. They drop back under pressure, escaping, and he's got some room racing to the left side. And he's gonna get hit out of bounds, and but not before. He picks up the first down, and he scrambles away. He got, again, Central Arkansas has been bringing pressure all day. They get right to him, but then he just escapes right away. It's a decent running quarterback and gets the first down. So a good play right there, and it's now first down and 10 once again. I know you are. I know you are, uh, Bray Wyatt. I know you are, man. All right, here we go. Big time play here coming up. We got 10-44 to go here in this one. First down and 10. Under the, uh, uh, now under the shotgun. Now the play fake. Now swings it off. And now oh, good. good. You know what? Good play right there. Gets around four yards on that reception. And you know what? He should have been tackled for a loss right there. But was not broke free of it. And it's now second down and six here for Austin. The Austin Governors. I'm just going to call him Austin P. That's what it is. I just, I'm, I haven't having a hard time saying that name. 10 10 to go here in the fourth quarter. It's 13 to 10. We've got an intense and close game for you guys here in the first game of the college football season. Second down and six. Taking it under the shotgun here. You got the halfback behind him. Pressure coming. They throw it on the screen. Got to break the tackle. Cannot. A great tackle right there. And he loses a yard. And it's third down and seven. Beautiful, beautiful play. And that's exactly what they need. It's third down and six, pardon me. But that, that was just a beautiful play. They saw the screen and just wrapped him up on the legs. Third down and six, nine, 30 to go. You're in the fourth quarter. Yeah, I don't. I sorry, Manny. I do not know what type of injury he got. Um, they if they haven't alerted the uh the TV yet because oh they haven't alerted or at least what I'm watching on. Yeah, it's it's over for the Blazers, man. We knew that though when he went down. Here we go. The screen pass. He's oh oh my. He dropped it. He dropped the screen pass. He dropped the screen pass. It's incomplete and it's fourth down and six and they're gonna have to punt it away because they're they're, they're they're at their own 25 yard line. They're gonna have to punt this football away here. Fourth down and six. Nine minutes and 11 seconds to go here in this one. The punting team will come out. Make sure if you have not already, drop down who you guys are cheering for. And if you guys want more of these college football live streams, definitely do subscribe to the channel. Turn the notifications on. I will for sure be back Monday for the, uh, what do you call them, for BYU and Navy. And then I'm sure I'll be live for one next Saturday as well. And the uh, punt is away. 
and it's going to be a terrible punt. It's going to be – it's a 50. It's only to the 50-yard line. It's a 20-yard punt. A 20-yard punt right there, and Central Arkansas takes over at the 50-yard line now. Wow, and we're going to a commercial timeout. The Lakers have officially won the series, everybody. I'm an idiot. The tackle was from UCLA, uh, UCLA, not UC. Uh, yeah, okay, okay. That's what. That's what I. That's what I, I was like. Yeah. Didn't expect this game to be a low score. No, I don't think a lot of people did. Nope. I. I. That's. I was, the line was 44 for the game, or something like that. Uh, uh, most people were picking over, but I. But I said I picked under. I picked under. And uh, Central Arkansas. I didn't actually bet, but I made mock bets. Um, like, didn't actually put money on it. But I knew, at, if I'm saying I would bet under on most of these games to start the college football season off. We're, they're rusty. It's rusty. A lot of turnovers and stuff like that. So that's why. And I really just didn't know. I just made an educated guess on who I went with. But we got 18 in the chat, guys. Man, I do appreciate everyone tuning in. Mystery. All things. This is probably going. Oh, sorry. Mystery. All things considered, this is probably how the first quarter of this. Yeah, for real. It, you've got a point, Bill. You you really do. As again, for pe those who just joining us, we are in a commercial timeout, guys. Smash up the like. Hit that subscribe button if you are new. And don't forget, guys, to ring that notification bell. Because the more people we have in the beginning of the streams, the better the stream tends to do. So, guys, ring that notification bell. Sorry if there's a little bit of lag. I can see that there is just a little bit of lag right now. Uh, but, again, I really do appreciate everyone who is stopping on in the stream, guys. You guys are, for real, the best, man. Really, really do appreciate it, man. Does mean a lot. As we are about to get back on our way here with some more basketball. Oh, goodness, I did it again. We're about to get back on our way here with some more action here. 13-10 to 10 here in the fourth quarter of play. 14 people in the chat. Your score breakdown. Austin P scored seven in the first, three in the second. And then Central Arkansas, 6 in the 2nd, and then 7 in the 3rd. Here we go. We are back. They're going to hand it off up the middle, and it's they're going to get around 2-3 yards on that carry. It will be 1st, or it'll be, sorry, it'll be 2nd down and 8. 2nd down and 8 underway here. Hey I'm, hey, I'm sorry for your loss, man, Vintage. I'm sorry for your loss. 2nd down and 8 here. 8.35 remaining here in this one. I know. I, I don't know why the punter is... Yeah, I don't know why the punter is their quarterback. It's messed up. Second down and seven. Takes another shotgun. Now the play action. He's wide open and shakes off a tackle and gets a few extra yards. And it's a face mask call. And they'll get 15 more yards added on after that. It's a big time first down. Clear face mask. Just ripped off his entire helmet right there. Treat the like button like a girl and smash it. Just like Dollar Beer said, man. Treat it like a girl, bro. Bro. Boom. Just smash it. You know what I mean, bro. Yes, sir. Hey, I ain't doing that. No, I ain't doing that none of stuff. Not yet, bro. But all my adults who are listening, you already know, bro. Smash that like, man. I do appreciate it, man. Just got news. Why does him out the game? Oh, man. That sucks, Manny. That really does suck. Oh, man. Here we go, but yeah, clear face mask right there. First and 10, I'll, I'll let you guys know where they have the ball here in just a second. And it's, uh, man, Central Arkansas really looking to to put this one away here in this one. It's okay, they yeah, they did. They they really did. They really they really did play, you know, for, for what they had. They played well. 8-19 here to go in this fourth, fourth quarter. Here we go. They've got it at the 21-yard line of Austin P. Here we go, Smith, under the shotgun. Now, you know, Duck pitches it to the left side, powering through, good run right there on the outside, broke a tackle, and then got a few extra yards. It'll be a first, not a first down, but it'll be a good pickup right there. First down, or sorry, second down, second and three, so yeah. Great pickup right there of seven yards there. Second down and three at the 14-yard line. Here it is. A bad snap. Reed sets itself. Now scrambling away from pressure on the right side. Throws it away, and that's going to be incomplete. Great defense right there. Second down and three. You're going to bed. Hey, why? Well, I appreciate you tuning in. Hope to see you in some future streams, man. You have yourself a fantastic rest of your night, brother. You have yourself a fantastic rest of your night.
Man, do appreciate it again, everyone. Tune on in. Keep smashing the like and subscribe. How many tackles does Hector Alvarez have for the uh, Austin Governors? I am not sure, man. I, I'm sorry, man. Um, I'll try on the next commercial timeout, Aaron. I'll try and get that for you, all right? 7.53. Third down and three. Third down and three. Big time play coming up right here. Takes it under the shotgun. That should have been an offside. They don't call it. Lux throws it, and it's incomplete. They can't grab onto it. Tough luck right there. Fourth down and three in the field goal team. Most likely going to come on here. Fourth down and three. And let's see it. Well, it's one. It should have been an offside. It should have been an offside. They missed the call. And then, you know, let's see. It's good D. And, man, he almost was able to hold that one in. And the field goal team is now entered. 13 to 10. They look to make this a six-point game. It's a 32-yard attempt. Good snap, good hold, it's up, and it's good. And it's 16 to 10, just like that. They're now up a touchdown, but a touchdown and an extra point would give them the win for Austin. 7.44 to go in this one. Austin P. down in this one by six. They will have the ball when we do come back. And we are having a kickoff now. Soon, after we do get back from this commercial timeout. And you want to know how many tackles Austin... I don't know how I'm going to be able to get that for you, man. I don't really... They're not keeping too many, like, stats on the game. But hold on, man. Let me let me see what I can do for you, brother. We got 15 people in the chat, man. If you are in here, let me know. We got 744 to go in this one. Who do you guys think is going to pull it out? Let me know in the comment section. I want all 15 people in here to comment down who they think is going to win this game. Team stats, um, there's not much I can, yeah, there's box score, and you wanted who's, you wanted Hector Alvarez, oh, I'm not, sorry, it's not up on the stats, man, so I'm not going to be able to get that for you, brother, I'm sorry, we got 18 people in the chat, we've got a tight game, we are on a commercial timeout, everybody, we are on a commercial timeout right now, it is 16 to 10, Austin, uh, Austin, uh, the Austin Generals will or that's not right, right? The Austin Generals? I think so. Uh, they, uh, Austin P will have the ball when we do get back from this commercial timeout. They are going to be receiving the kickoff. Welcome in, BB3 Jack Burtmont. We'll have him come in, and I'll give him a mod. I told you this, dude. Austin needs to put in second QB Mike Chandler. He is way better QB. Yeah, and you know, you know, I will say that for sure. He, Their QB has struggled here. He started the game off actually really well, uh, the Austin QB, but... Just ever since he he is he definitely has been struggling this one. Yeah, but let me know who you guys think is gonna win this game. Smash that like button. Let's get to 70 likes. And if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We're gonna be doing this type of content all NBA live stream. All I meant all college football season long. I will be back. Um, I will be back on uh, Saturday for some more college football games, and I will be back on Monday on Labor Day for BYU and Navy. So I hope to see you guys there. Subscribe. Turn on the notifications. Here we go, baby. Fourth quarter, we got around 744. Generals come in clutch. I got money on the line, man. We shall see. Welcome in, Jack Burke. Jack Burke, I'm trusting you, brother. I'm, I'm trusting you, man. All right, 16 to 10. You're welcome on the mark. Hey, there you go, bro. But if you misuse that, I am going to be very 22 in the chat. Let's go, man. You did. Hey, man, you're right, man. FCS game, we still got 22 in the chat. Let's go, man. I appreciate the support, everybody. Here's the kickoff from Central Arkansas. It's up, and it's boomed away, and it's going to be sure. Nope, it's going to go in the end zone, and most of his kickoffs have gone in the end zone, and it's going to be first down and 10, both the 25-yard line. First down and 10 coming up. A big-time possession here coming up. I appreciate it, Jack. I appreciate it, brother. You've been here for a while now, so I got you, man. You're welcome. BB3 was an advocate for you, man. 23 in the chat, man. Do appreciate everyone tuning in. Safety Hector Apple says five tackles tonight. Well, thank you, mister. I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you getting all these stats for us today. And it's, nope, the same quarterback is in, Jacob. In case you're still in here, the same quarterback is still in. First down and 10, ball at the 25-yard line. Here we go. Under the uh, steps under the gun, looking fires over the left side and it's incomplete. Could not knock man. A and Jacob is absolutely right right now. They just cannot make the plays, man. 
Second down and 10, and ooh, it appears an offensive lineman, Brown. Um, the offensive lineman, Brown, for Austin. The Austin Generals is down. Um, Elijah Brown, 253. He weighs 253. He's a senior, and he's 6'3". He appears to be grabbing that wrist as he is walking off the he is walking off the the, the field. All right, here we go. 26 in the chat. Do appreciate everyone tuning in. Second down and 10. 7.39 to go in this one. In the shotgun. Here we go. Austin Austin P. Looking to get something done. Going to hand it off of the middle. Look, and it's, and it's Sneed. Sneed powering his way through. And Sneed picks up a nice gain right there. Picks up around seven yards. It'll be third down. Third down and probably around three. It's the Governor's Austin. Yeah, Governor's. Okay. I'm going to call him Governor's because P I, I don't know what it is with that, man. 26. I appreciate it. I, I know. Hey, come on, Vintage. Don't get me mixed up now. Third down and two. Big time play. You're 705 remaining here in the fourth quarter. They're going to hand it off to Sneed. Sneed looking to break tackles. Cannot. They stop him short. It's fourth down and two. A beautiful stop by the defense right there. And it's fourth down and two. And now the big question is, will they punt this ball or will they go for it here with 6.45 to go? We don't have the answers just yet. How much money do you have on this one? I don't have any money on this one, man. I, if I, if I, but I made a prop bet. Not, well, like I, like I didn't actually make it, but I predicted what I thought. I had Central. Uh, I had uh, Central Arkansas minus five, and then the under. And I was well, looks like I'm gonna be right on both of those so far. Sixteen to ten to score. Make sure to smash the like, hit that subscribe button. Fourth down and two. It looks like they're going for it. Or they actually? They are. They're going for it. Never mind. They will punt that ball away. They're gonna punt that one away, and it takes a good bounce, and they'll pin them down at around the 24 yard line. The 24 yard line is where. The Central Arkansas will start, and Austin, the Austin Governors need a stop here. They have to get a stop in this one. I like the Governors QB. Well, he's been struggling recently, man. He, I mean, he has. And guys, we got 24 in the, 25 in the chat. I do appreciate everyone stepping on in, guys. Smash up that like button, guys. Smash up the like button. If you are new to the channel, guys, hit that subscribe button, guys. I really do appreciate all that support. If you guys want more of this college football content, Smash the subscribe button. I'll be live. I'm going to be doing these all college football season long. Subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss when we go live. First down and 10. 603 Smith under the uh, in shotgun formation right now. Wide receiver in motion. Switching over to the left side. Takes it. Hands it off. And working on the left side. And he's got nowhere to go. He maybe picks up a yard. And it's going to be second down. Oh, switch ball. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. Alrighty, switch ball. Thank you. All right, it is Central. It is Central Arkansas ball. Somebody so will catch a game winning touchdown for Austin Governors, and it will be 17 16 final. That would be absolutely crazy, man. That would be crazy. Here we go. Second down and nine underway. Takes it under the our, uh, shotgun formation. Second down and nine. Big time play right here. He's going to play action. Got a tight end open, but a nice tackle right there. And just like that, it's now third down and seven. And, and it's, it's stuff like that. That's a big time play right there. Big time play. Well, let's go Arkansas probably. Hey, we'll see, man. Third down and seven, five minutes to go here in this one. We've got a great game going on right now. Keep smashing the like button, guys. Hitting that subscribe if you are new to the channel and enjoying what you're seeing. I'm going to be doing it all college football season long. Third down and seven in the shotgun formation. Almost made him jump off sides, but he held his ground. Ten remaining here to get this, to snap the ball here. Here we go. Third down and seven. The biggest play of the game for Austin, the Generals. Here we go. Pressure coming. He escapes. He throws it. Dish it. Does he get the first down? He's short. So he is short. Or do they mark him? Where do they mark him? The biggest call of the game. They mark him in end short. Or a yard short. And they force the punt. It's fourth down and one. A humongous stop by the defense. And a player is down for Austin. A player is down for Austin. What a what a big time play. That is big time right there. It does not get much better than that. 
Wow. Man, oh man, 20, 16 to 10 the score, 425 you're remaining in this one. Guys, again, smash the like, hit that subscribe, and if you are enjoying it, I do not know, Manny. I do not know, but we got 21 people up in the building, man. I really do appreciate all the support, guys. Here we freaking go. 425, 4th and 1. Are they going to go for it here? Are they going to go for it? Such, this is such a big call. And I'm sorry for the if it's lagging at all, guys. It, I don't know what's going on. And he's walking off the floor. He seems like he's going to be okay here. 16 to 10. Oh, baby. This is such a, such an, oh, man. 4th down and 1. Man, I'm loving it. I miss college football so much. I really did. I missed it. I missed it so much. And they are going to punt it. They are going to punt this ball away. Fourth down and one here. Here we go. The punt here with 425 to go. Make sure to comment down who you guys think is going to win this game. Let me know in the comment section below. And they're going to punt it away. It's a good punt right there. And it's going to get out of around the 30-yard line. Who do you want to win? To me, it doesn't matter who wins this game. I just want a great game. I want a great finish. I hope it comes out. I hope it's a Hail Mary finish. What a game we have got going on right now. We've got around four minutes to go. 22 people in the chat. I do appreciate everyone who is stopping on into the stream, guys. You guys are for real the best, man. I, I, I just I really do appreciate all the support, guys. 23 in the chat. Smash the like and subscribe. Again, I'm going to be doing this all college football season long. I'll probably be back for another game on uh, Saturday. There's only a few. And then I will 100% be back for BYU and Navy. BYU and Navy, Labor Day on Monday. Govs are totally going to score 17-16. We, we shall see. 4-16 to go. They got it at the 40-yard line. I'm sorry. They got it at the 40-yard line. Here we go. First down and 10. Going to throw it deep down the field. Got him in. Got it down the field. What a play. First down. What a game changer. Unbelievable. Look at this. Takes his time. Escapes with the pressure. Throws it off balance. And got him at the, like, the 20-yard line. What a fantastic play. It's Jonas Orton. I have no idea. Here we go. 16 to 10. They've got it at the 17 yard line with 353 remaining. If you have not done so already, smash the like. Hit that subscribe button as well. What a fantastic catch it was, man. That that was that was absolutely fantastic. 342 to go. Takes it under the gun. Steps back. Looking. Throws to the end zone. No flag is called. It's incomplete. Second down and 10. I like the aggression, though. I like the aggression to go to the end zone right after that play. Second down and 10 now. But, man, that one play, that, that last play to get him at the 17-yard line was unbelievable. Second down and 10. 335. You're remaining in this one. Who's your favorite college team? Right here, baby. Go Bulls. University of South Florida. My second favorite is the University of Michigan. Second down and 10 here. Under the shotgun. Such a big drive coming on right now. A chance to take the lead. Here we go. Second down and 10. Under the shotgun. Looking to the left side. It's tipped and not going to be caught. It's incomplete. Third down and 10. Man, oh man. Oats, Oats of all. And Oats of all playing. You know, you know what? For a bad of a game as he played, they're still in this. And he hasn't even played that bad. So here we go. Third down and 10. Let me change that up for you guys. It is third down and 10. What a game we have got going on. If you have not done so already, smash the like. Hit that subscribe button. 3.30 to go in this one. I'm going to be doing this type of content all college football season long. Can we get three new subscribers by the end of this stream, guys? Can we get three new ones? Can we do it? Let's try and get three new ones. Here we go. Under the, under, under the shotgun formation. Here we go. Play action. Never mind. He does hand it off. He's got some running room. Brian Sneed does not get it, though. And he is short, and it's fourth down. It is fourth down and around five. The biggest play now of the game is coming up. Oh, my goodness, man. Man, I miss college football. This might be an FCS game, but I miss college football. I love this, man. We got 30 in the chat now. Let's go. Three minutes to go. Fourth and four. I believe they're going for it here. They are. They've got nothing to lose. Here we go. 
Fourth and four. Under the shotgun. Looking. Throws it to the end zone. It's incomplete, but it's a pass interference. It's a pass interference, and it'll be a first down. Oh, are you serious, man? Are you serious? First down and goal probably now. Yes, they went for it, and they got it too. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. A, oh, oh, wow, what a man. And it's going to be first down and goal most likely. Welcome in, I will. Welcome in, Vintage State Humble Bill. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Wow. What a game to start, Colin Swipple. Think about how great this is going to be all season, guys. Smash the like. Hit the subscribe button. Let's freaking go. Let's go. We got one more subscriber. One more subscriber to now reach our new goal. Let's go. Smash it up. We got 31 in the chat. First down and goal. First down and goal. Here we go. First down and goal at the two-yard line. At the two-yard line. I said it. Smiley, so you did. Here we go. First down and goal. Here we go. Ball at the two-yard line. All they got to do is knock this one in the end zone and then make the extra point. They're at the two-yard line. Here we go. They're going to do a pitch, then do a reverse. Here it is. Trying to get the end zone reaches. He's a yard short. So second and goal. Second and goal. He just missed it. He reached. Could not find it. But he's yet a go He's an inch short away. Hi, I'm new in your stream. I just liked and subscribed. I really do appreciate that. I'm going to be doing this all, all college football season, guys. So that is something you guys do want to uh, t tune in for. Definitely hit that subscribe button. I'm going to be doing four streams uh, a weekend once the season really gets kicked going. But here we go, man. I appreciate it again, everyone. Stopping on into the stream in a second. Down and goal. A chance now to take the lead under two minutes to go now in this one. Under two minutes to go. Oh, my God. Delay again. Oh, my God. A delay again. Or did they get the timeout off in time? Did they get the timeout off in time? They did. They will award them the timeout even though they missed it. He did not get that time off. It, it, he did not get that time off in time. Look at that. Bad call. Bad call right there, bro. That is a bad call. Wow. That should have been. They should not have awarded that timeout, man. They should not have awarded that. Oh, okay, Ali. What? Oh my gosh. Y'all are tripping, bro. Whatever. Okay. All right. Second down and goal here, man. Such a pivotal, such a pivotal, pivotal moment here in this game. Again, smash that like if you guys have not done so already. Hit that subscribe button if you are new. Really do appreciate that. Thank you for hiding Vintage. I, pe Vintage, people. I, I don't even get people. Thank you for handling that. 149 remaining here in the fourth quarter. And second down and goal. The biggest play of the entire game. Second down and goal. They are literally an inch away. And when I mean an inch away, they are an inch away. They're, they're literally an inch away here. Let's go. Welcome in Fem JNC. Welcome on into the stream, man. Appreciate you stopping on in. Second down and goal. 149 to go here in the fourth quarter. They're going to hand it off. He's going to die. He starts. He didn't get it. Third down and goal. What a stand by the defense. 140 to go. Wow. Wow. Yeah, and that, that, that's beautiful. That is beautiful defense right there. It's now third down and goal. 140 remains in this one. And I believe a timeout was called right there. It is a timeout is called, right? Yep. Timeout is called by Central Arkansas. Timeout is underway, man. We got 31 in the chat. If you have not done so already, smash that like. Hit that subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel, guys. We've got a great game going on right here. What a way to open the college football season. I know they need to, man. Hey, I don't know what the deal is. And sorry, sorry for all this time. What is going on? All right, we got 34 in the house now. Welcome on in, everybody. Man, oh, man. This is it, man. I really appreciate this, guys. I really do. Smash the like and subscribe. I will be doing more college football games throughout the season. I'll be back on Saturday for some more. And I will also be live for BYU and Navy. BYU and Navy. I will be live for on Monday on Labor Day. So if you guys want to 
Tune in for that one again. We are about to get underway with this huge play right here. We got 34. If they score, if who scores, um, if which team scores, if J Jimmy, if um, what do you call it? Austin scores. Third down and goal from the two yard line. Here we go. They hand it off. It's a fake handoff. They died. It's a touchdown. We are tied in this one. A beautiful fake handoff right there. And the quarterback keeps it. And it's Oaks of all diving in. We are tied. 16 16 with 140 to go. Wow. Wow. What a beautiful fake handoff. And now they got to go for one. Obviously, go for one here. The biggest extra point of their life. Uh, um, I, I'm going to try and stream some NBA tomorrow. I'm going to try and stream some NBA tomorrow. Here we go. The biggest extra point of his life. It's goal. He got it. Oh, my God. I swore he almost missed that, y'all. Holy crap. And it's 17 to 16. 140 to go. And it's now Central Arkansas. Central Arkansas, Arkansas ball. Holy crap, ladies and gentlemen, what a way to start off the college football season. If, again, you have not done so already, guys, smash up that like button, guys. Smash it up. New to the channel, hit the subscribe button, guys. It really does help out. You guys are you guys are awesome, man. I'm going to be doing tons of more college football. Smash the like and subscribe, and don't forget to turn on that notification. Hey, let's get it, man. Wow. What a, what a, what a moment. What a game. I love you, though. I appreciate it. Well, hopefully you subscribe to the channel. 940 to go. Wow, man. I miss college football. I miss it. This is why I knew I wanted to do the FCS game. Because it's college football. I love it. I have a, the biggest passion for this game. I love it. That is a beautiful play. Coming right down to the wire to start off the season. The, the, you couldn't have asked for a better opening game to start the season. You could not have asked for a better opening game. Fantastic. Here we go. 17 to 16 is the score here in this one. Here we freaking go. 140 to go. Kickoff is underway, ladies and gentlemen. Don't go anywhere, guys. Don't go anywhere because this game is not over yet. The kickoff is up. It's short. It's going to be received at around the five yard line. Now looking for a solid return. Trying to break free. Cannot. And he's going to get around to the 20. 522 yard line around something like that 134 to go all they need is a field goal they don't need a touchdown they need a field goal i love the energy keep up these this excitement why well, i appreciate it uh fam. just I, I love college football man I, i'm doing what i love who scored the td it was um no it was it was actually none of them it was um it was uh oats oats no oh, the quarterback oh something whatever whatever his name was i subscribed i love your energy i appreciate that man 134 to go here we go. It's first down and 10. Crap, let me change that real quick. First down and 10. Such a big drive here. We are with that that is coming up right now. Here we go. First down and 10. Underway. Takes it under the shotgun. Looking. Throws it. Got him in. And he's gonna only get five yards, but there is a flag. There is a flag, and I'm not exactly sure what that's gonna be. Hold on. This is a big call, guys. This is a big call. And the head referee looking for the side referee to to make his decision on what this call is going to be. How many timeouts? Um, both teams have two remaining timeouts. What's it going to be? Offsides. Offsides. So they will obviously accept that penalty. It's now first down and five. First down and five here. So, man, I mean, I, I'm, I'm loving every bit of this, y'all. I'm loving every bit of this. Here we go. Let's Let's see again. If this was really offsides, oh, I'm just trying to take a look at this and see. And they did it, their thing froze, so it did not show. And here come the flags. Yeah, here we go, man. Here we go, man. Just keep smashing the like, getting that subscribe, everybody. Here we go. First down in five. Ball at the 27 yard line of Central Arkansas. They need a field goal to win this game. Plenty of time. You're absolutely right. Takes it back on the shotgun. Looking, looking, looking. Dishes over to the side. Got to make a cut. Does make a cut, breaks a tackle, breaks the board, hits the sideline, gets out of bounds as well. 118, the clock stops as he picks up the first down. Then will go to first down and 10. What are you watching on, uh, can I ask? Absolutely, man, I'm watching on ESPN. 
So um, I'm, I'm streaming for the game that people that don't have cable. So that is what I'm watching on. But of course, if you have ESPN, obviously go over to ESPN and watch that game, man. 118 to go, first down and 10, ball at the 38 yard line of Central Arkansas. Looking, looking back, throws it. Never mind, he's got escape from pressure, now throws it, and it's caught, and he steps out of bounds. Another first down reception right there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. First down and 10, 110 to go here in this one. Oh, baby, Central Arkansas looking to possibly close this one out. Smash the like and the subscribe if you have not done so already. I will be back on Saturday for another one stream. And then I'll be back on for Monday on Labor Day for BYU Navy. First down and 10. Shotgun. Here we go. Smith looking back in the pocket. Throws. He's got a man and he catches it. It's going to be second down and four now. They've got to act quick. One, oh, one minute to go. Whoops. Sorry about that. One minute to go. Second down and four. Now 55 seconds to go as the clock comes ticking down. Here we go, second down at four. Looks back, looking, looking, dishes over to the side. Didn't know the pass was coming, and it's incomplete. Door down and four with 47 seconds to go. Holy crap, 47 seconds to go. I know, um, uh, Austin Generals just came down, and they took the lead, man. It was crazy. It's going to be a nightmare for Austin when, hey, we'll see, man. We'll see what happens, brother. Third down and four, 47 seconds to go in this one. Such a big freaking play right here. Here we go. Oh, they're looking here for the play. They tried to draw him offside. Third down and four. Ten seconds to get this snap off here. They've got to get it off somewhat quick. Here we go. Five seconds. Third down and four. Here we go. 47 seconds. Pressure coming. They throw it. Take down the field. It's caught! It's caught! They got a call timeout right there! They got a call! Never mind, they don't! They don't need to! It's caught at the 10 yard line! First down and 10! Look at that! Goes one on one with them! What a throw! And most importantly, what a catch! First down and 10! But no, first down and goal! 40 seconds to go! Here we go! In the shotgun formation, can they win this game? Trey Savage, you're all good, man. I appreciate you tuning in now, brother. I really do. Appreciate you stopping in. And it's first down and going. A timeout is called. Holy cow, ladies and gentlemen. This is college football. This is why it is my favorite sport of all time. All time. I love it, dude. I absolutely love this sport with a passion. I love it, dude. Whether it's FCS, whether it's high school ball, whether it's NFL, I love. But college football is the best. There's nothing better than college football. Opening day. This is what we get. I'm, I'm loving this, man. I want to be doing this all college football season long. So smash the like. Hit that subscribe if you have not done so already. Here we go. They've got first down and goal with 40 seconds to go. What a game. Wow. Um, the ball is at the 10-yard line. As you can see, I have first and goal. So it is at the 10-yard line. We got 34 in the chat. Can we get to 80 likes on this stream? Can we get to 80 likes? We're one like away. And guys, keep smashing that subscribe button, guys. This growth during the stream has been incredible. I was not expecting this much growth on this stream, man. So I really do appreciate it. First down and goal. A chance to take the lead with under a minute to go. 40 seconds remain. Here we go. Wide receiver goes in motion. Motion throws it up for the end zone. Got him. Touchdown. Touchdown. Are you serious? Are you serious, man? Touchdown. And just like that, they've taken the lead. 22 to 17 the score. Unbelievable. It's Luan Winningham with the go-ahead touchdown with 34 seconds to go. Are you serious, man? Are you serious? What a game. Wow. 22-17, and now they got it. Not, they don't have to go for two. They don't have to go for two, but I think they're going to. They, they should. Holy crap. No, they're kicking the extra point. Okay. Yeah, good call. They're going to call a timeout here. Yeah, timeout. I believe that they're going to kick the... I believe that they're going to go for two here. Let's see. Let's make sure he has his feet down. One, two, three. You betcha. 
There we go. Welcome in, everybody. Hey, we got a $4.99 donation from my brother, Dre Savage, man. I do appreciate it. Hey, it's all good when you have a busy day, man. Totally understand it. I appreciate you tuning in while you can. What a game we've got going on. Let's get some dono hype in the chat, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. What happened? They just got a touchdown with 30 seconds to go. Unbelievable stuff. Welcome in. No burnt. I will. Bill. Wow. I say game, but Austin could. They could. This game not over yet, ladies and gentlemen. It is not over yet, guys. And and no way is this game over yet, man. Really do appreciate that donation, though, man. Guys, smash up the like, guys. Let's get to 80 likes. And if you are new to the channel and you want to see more of this college football content, smash the subscribe button. I'm going to be doing these live streams all NBA, all college football season long, guys. All college football season long. Let's get two more subscribers by the end of the stream, guys. Two more subscribers. I'll be live on Saturday, uh, probably for uh, Middle Tennessee. And Army, and then on Monday for BYU and Navy. So subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification. Here we go, the two-point conversion. Here we go. They're going to hand it off. No, it's going to be a rollout to the tight end. He's going to die for the pylon. Is it? Signal it. Yes, sir. He got it. It's a seven-point game with 34 seconds to go. Man, oh, man, it's now 24 to 17. And, and you know what? That was a beautiful tight end rollout right there. Beautiful design play right there. Not yet, man. That is that. That was fan. That was a fantastic play. How can you donate? Uh, obviously, you don't have to know. Uh, but if you see right here, uh, I'm trying to show you the screen. You see that button right there? That button right there. If you click it, and then you can uh, decide how much you want to donate. If you would like to make a donation, just you know, 10% of all income that we make here on the channel does go back to cancer research. So your donation would also go to something good of cause as well. What a game we have got going on, man! Smash the like, hit the subscribe. We've got kickoff now. We've got a kickoff coming up here in just a little bit. Wow! Oh wow! Can Austin PV now send this one to overtime? What what are what do we have in store for us now? This is crazy. Yeah, holy cow, man! I really do appreciate all the support, man. And if you think these streams are exciting, wait till wait till we get into the, the to the top ten matchups like Alabama, Texas A and M, and and Notre Dame and stuff like that in LSU, Alabama. Oh, just wait for those streams, guys. Just wait. It's gonna be late. Here's the kickoff underway, and it's going to be. A touchback. He just stays in the end zone, takes a knee. It'll be first down and 10 at the 25. They got two timeouts to work with. This game is not over yet. All righty. Can they send this bad boy to overtime? Woo! What a game, man. 34 seconds to go. Let me know what you guys think is going to happen. Can Austin? Can the Austin Governors come back and win this game right here and right now? Can they do it? Let me know in the comment section down below. Let me know. Hey, what if we have the Hail Mary? Is no why. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I got you no why. Well, there you go. I'm, I'm sorry about that. Really, again, do appreciate everyone tuning in. Like, I will burnt crabs. I really do appreciate it. Bill, welcome in. I know Bill is excited. First down and 10. They got, oh my God, they're, they're about to do it. Delay again. They did it again. Oh, wait, they didn't call it. Now they did. Another delay of game that I've been talking about it all the time. How do you have a delay of game? How? And it's going to be first down to 15. That's careless. That's careless. That is careless. That is absolutely careless. Wow. First down and 15 now. Bro, I expect Austin to go three now. Yep. Wait. Oh, no. Illegal substitution. I take it back. It is an illegal substitution. Yeah, no, my TV is actually on point right now, and, and it's not delayed, so uh, there is no interception, I'm pretty sure. Jameen, if you th I'm trash, if you think I'm trash, then you can just leave. Oh, like, nobody's forcing you to be here, but okay. First down and five here. Holy cow, what a game we've got going on, man. I really do appreciate all the support, man. 34 seconds to go, first down and five upcoming here. Here we go. Takes another shotgun. Looking, he's scrolling to the right. He's got to find someone. Throws it down the field. And it's almost intercepted. And it's going to fall incomplete. It'll go for second and five now. Great. Great play right there. One's first down and then three now. Well, man. Oh, he had him in the middle. Oh, how did he not intercept that? 
How did he not intercept that? That was literally right in his hands. Wow. That might come back to bite him. All right, here we go. I'm really getting to appreciate everyone stopping it. 28 seconds to go. It's second down and five at the 30-yard line. Looking, they throw over the middle. First down and more to the 50. And he's down at the 45 with 21 seconds. They got to stop the clock. because They stop the clock because it is a first down. Just like I told you guys, this game isn't over. Spike the ball. Spike the ball. And they will spike it right away with 19 seconds. It'll be second down and 10 now. Holy cow. All right, just like I said, not over just yet, ladies and gentlemen. Not over just yet. Time left, 18 seconds. Dre, 18 seconds to go in this one. Let's go. Smash the like if you have not done so already. Hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. And Austin does have two timeouts, so they are in good shape right now. They, they could get a touchdown here. Here we go. 24-17. On another shotgun. Looking. Throws it to the corner. Got a man. Oh, he dropped it. He dropped it. Oh, my God. Are you serious? Oh, my God. He dropped the ball. He dropped it. He just tried to get out of bounds too fast. That's what it was. He tried to get out of bounds, and so, therefore, he was so focused on that that, yeah. Wow. Third down and 10. 13 seconds to go. Wow. I cannot. I can actually not believe that. Uh, yeah, it's obviously going down the wire. 13 seconds to go. You almost want to throw it over the middle here if I'm Austin. I throw it over the middle here to around the 30-yard line. Here we go. They throw. They throw over the middle. And th oh, they dropped it again. Fourth down and 10, eight seconds. So here's the thing. Do you go for the end zone with eight seconds? It's now fourth down and 10. Chat, help me out here, okay? If you're them, it's now fourth down. Call a timeout because you have to. Schedule the play. Call a timeout. I ain't even biased. I don't care who wins this game. Call a timeout. Schedule the play. You've got two. And they will. Finally, somebody listens to me. I know what I'm talking about. Thank you. Goodness gracious, man. But here's the thing. They got eight seconds. So they've got, uh, they've got two options right now. One, they can do a quick out and go right down and call a timeout with like one second. And then throw it up from like the 30. Or they can go for the end zone now. Because in case... You know, you, you know, get, I don't even know how to explain this. You get tackled. No, but you got to time out. I say you throw it to the sideline and try and get out of bounds right away. Or even if not, just call a timeout right away. Do, a, do this. Boom. Post right. Have it right there. Do the little boom, boom. Bo have both people on the corner. Go right there to the corner. Pass the first down line. So you can, you can, you got to get the first down. That's the problem. they got to get the first down on this play. That's the only problem with going short here. Down on the corner. Other or. And then, you know, step out of bounds and then go for the Hail Mary for like from the 30. Otherwise, they're going from the 40. So it's going to be very interesting to see what they do. Fourth down and 10. Eight seconds again. Really again to appreciate all the support, man. You guys have made this stream an absolute blast. Before we do get another way with this, probably my final play. Smash the like. Hit the subscribe button, guys. Here we go. 24-17. I think they're just going to go for Hail Mary. I totally do. No, they're going to run the ball here. And they've got some room. And they're going to step out of bounds at the 26-yard line with two seconds to go. Call a timeout and figure out the play. You could. They've got one more. That was a beautiful design play. That was a beautifully designed play. It's now first down and 10. Holy cow. First down and 10. They've got 30 seconds here. Or are they going to call timeout? I don't think they're going to call timeout. They are. Yup, they are. A timeout has been called. Holy crap. What a game. What a game. We have got 33 people in the chat. Okay. Just for everyone knows. They've got the ball at the 26-yard line. Two seconds to go. They've got to throw it into the end zone here. Now, here's my question. If you get... The touchdown, do you kick the extra point or do you risk it and you go for two? That's my question. I, I just, I, that's, I'm interested to hear what, if you were the coach and, and, and Austin gets this touchdown, what do you do? Do you kick the extra point or do you risk it and you go for the win? What do you do here? Two seconds to go. Guys, before we do call this play, guys, again, if you have not done so already, smash the like, hit that subscribe button, guys. Let's try and get two new ones. Two new subscribers, guys. Let's freaking get it, man. 
My power just, well, I'm sorry to hear that, but hey, I'm glad I could cover the game for you two seconds to go. First down and ten. Here we go. Seven on the, see how to hike it. Here we go. They get it underway. They throw it. They heave it to the end zone. It's picked off. Picked off. And here they come down the floor. They step out of bounds. And that will end the game. And they win game one in thrilling fashion here, ladies and gentlemen. The Hail Mary goes for not, it was not even close. 24 to 17 is your final score. The Central Arkansas, the Central Arkansas Bears get the win in week one and week zero actually over the Austin Generals, man. What a game this was. Wow. And this one is a done deal, ladies and gentlemen. 33 people in the chat, man. Y'all are absolutely fantastic, man. I really, really do appreciate all the support on this stream, guys. Keep smashing that like, hit that subscribe button. We will have a short little post-game talk right now, but I am extremely tired because I've been live for... How, how long have I been live for for this game? I've, I've been live for almost four hours. In around two minutes, I've been live for four hours for this game, man. So... Smash the like, hit that subscribe, and if you guys are new to the channel, let's try and get two more. Come on, I know there are two people in here who still not smashed that subscribe button, man. But man, oh man, I really appreciate it. Randy Mahomes, Vintage, Samuel S Central uh, for the week one cash. Had to throw 15 on it for making it. Hey, Samuel, well, congratulations on winning your bet, man. That's exactly what I would have picked, too. So, congratulations to you, man. The nightmares have started for the Austin Governors. Yeah, man. Tough game, but hey, they played well. You know what? They, they, they lost the game in the final 40 seconds. This was a thrilling game. From the first play from scrimmage was a 75-yard rushing touchdown. I, this game was thrilling. Uh, and then a, a tied touchdown with a minute 40. Then a go ahead, or the go, two go-aheads in the final two minutes of this game. This was an absolutely fantastic game, man. I, 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 wow. I love college football. If you love college football too, this is the home for college football because man oh man and i also do nba here on this channel don't forget i do nba mob um college basketball uh, mob all these good stuff here on the channel man so smash the like subscribe and don't forget guys to turn on that notification bell so you never miss when i do go live wow what a what a fantastic game this was guys i, I I'm, I'm gonna hold off on ending it until we reach four hours on the stream because I would love to to reach four hours on this. That's why I love call. I love it, man. I love it. Thanks for another great stream. I I appreciate it, Vintage. You you the man. You are the man. I appreciate everyone who stopped on in and and tuned in the stream, guys. It, it really does mean a lot, guys. It really does mean a lot. I had a fantastic time covering this game, and I will. And I and you know what? I am looking forward to calling. Uh, and I'm looking forward to calling the rest of these college football games with you guys. I hope some of you guys can uh, tune back in for some of them. Um, I'm going to read you guys for those who are still in here. Uh, my upcoming schedule. for uh, I'm probably going to do the Utah-Denver game tomorrow. I'm probably doing the Utah-Denver game tomorrow. If you guys want to uh, tune into that one, I will be live for that game. Maybe. Maybe possibly. Um, and, we look at, and we look at the schedule now. Man, oh man. Um... Uh, Thursday, I'm not gonna do any. I don't. I don't like the the, the I don't like the schedule for Thursday. Um, there, there is Arkansas, Central Arkansas, but I, I if 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 I can get access to that game, I will do that game. Um, but it's looking like on Saturday, I'm doing Middle Tennessee versus Army tentatively. If I can't do that one, I will do either SMU Texas State, uh, Houston Baptist North Texas, or Arkansas State Memphis. That'll probably be the one I do. And then on Labor Day, guys, on Labor Day, I am going to be doing. BYU Navy at around 7.50 Eastern Time. That is going to be a fantastic game. You're lining them up to advance. Uh, yes, we are, man. I'm excited about that. But BYU Navy Monday. So I hope you guys will join, join me in for those streams as well. Would you rather lose by a game by a lot of points or um, a little bit of points just because at least I know my team put, put forth the right amount of effort and, you know, that, that that's why. All right, see you, Luca. See you, man. I appreciate you tuning in. Go Bears. Hey, well, hey, Bill, I appreciate you tuning in. Congratulations to your Bears on the win, man. Big congrats to you, man. Appreciate everyone who tuned in, man. This is fantastic. I'm so excited for the college football season. Beyond excited. 
If you guys want any of my predictions for the college football season, let me know down in the, com co uh, the comments uh, in the comments in the live chat below, and I can answer some of those before I do head out for the night because I am extremely tired. I've been live for four hours, and uh, for those who don't know, I am on the Eastern Time Zone, and um, in the Eastern Time Zone right now, it is uh, 1247. So, uh, I don't know if y'all can see. I know I have total energy, and I know I'm excited. You, know, you you wouldn't think I'm tired, but as soon as I end this stream, bro, I am hitting the hay. I'm going to bed. I'm out, bro. I was up till 5 a.m. yesterday for some stupid reason. I don't know why. I'm just going to go to bed. Probably because I was so excited about college football. But, um, <laughs> I'm so tired, dude. I'm so tired. But I had to bring the energy for the stream. Great stream. Hope to see you uh, stream the Battle of the Org. Uh, San, but I, uh, let me screenshot that. And I will try my best to do so, man. I'm going to be doing all types of games throughout the season, man. So I will try my best. I'm glad you guys enjoy the stream. Yeah, BYU Navy, I think it's going to be a fantastic game. But again, I'm going to end this stream in just around two, three more minutes. If you guys want to leave any more thoughts down below on the stream, or if you guys just want to leave some predictions for the college football season below, or ask for mine, you know, just let me know. I'll stay on here for about two, three more minutes, and then I am hitting the hey. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Not one loud. Saw your post too. Uh, I thought it was late. What? Do you, wait. Uh, yeah. No. Yeah. My. Yeah. It is late. Wait. Wait. wait hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on. Let me laugh aloud. Saw your post too. I thought it was late. You saw my post. Uh, yeah. Right. Okay. 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 I get it now. I get it now. Yeah. But yeah, it is. It's almost one a.m. Dude. I am. I am losing it, man. But this this was fantastic, man. What a way to start the college football season out, man. What a game it was. I really do appreciate all the support, guys. And you know, the lightning wasn't too bad tonight. I will say that that is something I've you know been you know trying to to fix. And uh, for those who have been here before, you guys will know the uh, the struggle of lighting in the old house. But you know, the, you know what? It I it's a little bit it's a little bit like light at times, but it's better than the glare. And you know, when I look at it. It, it actually looks really good. Not really good, but it looks fine. I'm getting a ring light soon. My mic is coming soon. I'm going to get some LED lights soon as well. So better stuff is coming, but for what we had, it was it was not bad at all. Oh, okay, uh, Maurizio. Uh, all righty. Uh, sound, sound, uh, yeah. It, no? Uh, all right, yep. And that is going to be it for me, guys. I really do, again, appreciate all the support. I hope every one of you has a fantastic rest of your night. I will be live for the NBA sometime during these playoffs. Eventually, I will be doing them. So, hope you guys did enjoy the stream. And I will catch you all later, man. Until next time, have yourself a great rest of your day. Subscribe and turn on those notifications, guys. So you never miss when we go live. Hope you guys enjoy the stream. And every single one of you, have a great rest of your night. College football game number one is in the books, ladies and gentlemen. And we're going to be doing a whole lot damn more. Have yourself a fantastic night. Until next time, I'm out of here.